Hello, Rip and Chip community. Happy pre-Friday. Happy day before pre-release. Hope y'all are having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, got some great news. Getting all your stuff packaged up from this last week. So hopefully everything should be in the mail or at UPS by tomorrow, depending on uh, the option that ends up getting you your package the most efficient way. Uh, do appreciate everybody supporting us over the last week with the six streams we did. Kind of wild. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. Been packing cards all day yesterday, all day today. We'll be packing cards all day tomorrow. But uh, definitely having a lot of fun. Hope everybody uh, is ready for some more fun tonight. We do have Outlaws of Thunder Junction collector and play packs available. Technically, they're pre-sales. Um wouldn't be able to ship them out and you wouldn't be able to pick them up tonight anyway so the earliest you'd be able to pick them up uh would be the 12th everything purchased tonight ships out next week on thursday the 18th uh unfortunately we can't add anything to the packages because most of y'all stuff is already packed up um what else is important to know we do have battles tonight we uh we do still have battles available you can purchase battles at moonshotgamestore.com slash battle. It's pinned at the top of chat. Uh, we already filled up our first uh, Outlaws of Thunder Junction collector and play battle. 
We have one more play battle available. We need five more people for that. And we have two more collector battles available. Uh, for the second battle, we still need four more people right now. Collector packs are $23.49. Play packs are $4.99. Collector battles are $56.99. And play battles are $35.99. If you have any questions, let us know. We also have all of our other packs available this evening. Um, and then... For y'all that are interested, we'll be streaming on uh, Saturday afternoon, early afternoon, probably around 1 o'clock Eastern time with Queen Honey. So we're starting with Eric tonight. Eric has two separate orders. We're just going to open them together. He has uh, six Woke Collector Packs and two Raven Curry Master Collector Packs. Good luck. So you still can get in battles. We're not sold out of battles yet. And uh, just let me know if we sell out of anything. I'll see if we have any more. Um, the Sharpie attacked me a few times today, chat. It was not playing nice. Gonna lose my voice and feeling in my fingertips. No, I'm good. I'm good. We should be good. Definitely a little more tired than I have been, uh, just cause been, uh, packing all, uh, all day long. Come on, realistic study. That'd be a sick pull. Hopefully we can pull it for you. Here we go. Starting out with land tax. Get a foil mythic to start. Very nice. Leyline of Lightning, Virtue of Courage, uh, Adventure Frame, Mythic there. Thank you for subscribing. Shadow Puppeteers and Sentinel of Lost Lore for pack one. On to pack two. We do not ship to Zimbabwe. We only ship to the United States, unfortunately. But thank you for the question. I think we have an anime land tax here. Foil Twining Twins. We do. An anime land tax. Wild. Wow, double land tax. Lost of Dread Knight, Spiteful Hex Mage, and Twining Twins. The double Twining Twins in that pack. They're twinning about twining. Pack three. Raging Battle Mouse Foil Extended. Leyline of Abundance. Cruel Somnophage. Tag will extend a mythic. And Spiteful Hex Mage. Pack four. So how many y'all are uh, excited about tomorrow? Who's going to a pre-release tomorrow? Well, Iron Crag extended. Dirt Animosity. Twining Twins. Wow. Something the Lost Lore and Food Fight. Twining Twins, a popular card in these packs tonight. Going today. Are you in Europe, Summer Boys? I know, I'm pretty sure pre-releases aren't supposed to start till like two o'clock Eastern time tomorrow. I think I read that somewhere, but more power to whoever. Just don't let us know where it is. Nate, thanks for subscribing. Don't want anybody to get in trouble. Work all day tomorrow, understand that. Tangle Colony, full extended. Doubling season, nice mythic. Luna Grand Squall mythic, Lady of Laughter, and Hilda's Crown of Winter. Double Vampiric Rites. Yeah, doubling season's a great pull. Then we have a foil, Waste Knot, Leyline of the Void, Elusive Otter, The End, and Ingenious Prodigy. So unfortunately, we could not find a Ristic Study, but we do have two more packs. We have two Ravnikery Mastered Collectors. Good luck. Thank you all so much for the orders. I see them coming in. Mindly Mass, Old Border Foil, Spark Double Borderless, Karn's Bastion, Old Border, and a Quasi Duplicate. Is it Signet in that pack? Full Mayhem Devil as well. Last pack. Eric, thank you so much for grabbing some packs today. We have a Borderless, Bruvac the Grandiloquent, Foil Mythic, very nice. Reading Pool, Borderless Shock, Copy Enchantment, Old Border, Prize Shield. Do we get a bonus shock? Sadly, just a Guild Gate. But we tried, we tried. Eric, we're gonna get all these sleeved up for you. They'll ship out next week on the 18th. Uh, since you got that $10 shipping, if you wanna add any more packs tonight, Saturday, or on Monday's stream, as long as you stay under that 500 count box pool, you don't have to pay for shipping again. Jared up next, getting two collectors of Outlaws. First two collector packs of Outlaws of the night. Good luck. We're in a uh, brand new Master Case. 
We do have double masters 2022 collector and draft packs available tonight. Ionize full rare, Ionize non full rare, back in town, Ariette the wanted poster, and Generous Plunder big score mythic. Next pack here for Jared. Outlaws Merriment, Primal Might, Downy Board, Colossal Rattleworm, and Concealed Courtyard Fastland. There you go, Jared. We'll get those sleeved up. Uh, print quality's been pretty good. They're printed in Japan. If anything, the foils are reverse curling a little bit. Uh, but overall, seems like it's been pretty good to me. Uh, up next, we have MTG Cards in Review. Getting four Ravnikry Master Draft Packs for $19.99. Limit one per person per stream. We have one total box of these available tonight, so we should have, like, we had eight more. I think one or two other people got one, so I think we only have, like, six more left. And then Outlaws Collector for MTG Cards interview. I think Karlov Manor was printed in Japan as well, so maybe you're just not happy with the current card quality of Magic Cards. I can't remember, though. Actually, hold on, I'll check. Yeah, Karlov Manor, the collectors were printed in Japan as well. So if you didn't like the collector packs... In Karloff Manor, you won't like these either. Stitch in Time, Old Border, Rare. Hollowed Fountain, getting bonus shock. And Dread Boar. I don't know why I have two headphones in chat. I figured out just using one headphone is much better. Did it pause the music now? No, okay, music's still going. Can hear myself talk again. There we go. Uh, Midnight Reaper for MTG Cards interview. Let's see where we're at with battles. I heard some people signing up. We need three more people for Outlaws Collector Battle 2. Four more people for Outlaws Play Battle 2. I only have two play battles available tonight and three collector battles to start us out. Wow, another bonus shock. Overground Tomb. And Deathrite Shaman Old Borders. Some pretty fun Round Curry Master Packs there. Onto your Outlaws Collector. Appreciate everybody coming to hang out. We're already up to 88 people watching. Bruce Tarl, Full Extended, Dust Bowl, Murky and Spelljacker, Ty Wakeen, and Calamity, Galloping Inferno. Appreciate everybody hanging out. If you get a chance to gently tap that like button, we always appreciate it. We're only at 15 likes. We need to get to 50 ASAP. Got 10 people hanging out on Twitch. Thank you all so much. Our goal on Twitch tonight, let's make it be 740 followers. That would be cool. But we need seven more followers on Twitch. Uh, up next, we have Mitchell getting a collector pack of Outlaws. Had another person sign up for battle. Thank you. Mitchell, here you go. Calamity, full extended. Leyline Binding, nice mythic. Savvy Trader. Step Between Worlds and Campbell, Profiteering Mayor. There's the rest of your pack. We'll get those sleeved up. That would be nice, Isaac. Etherin. Is that how you say that? Hello, how you doing? Thanks for stopping by. Uh, Matthew up next, getting three Outlaws collector packs and two Double Masters 2022 collector packs. Good luck. Let's see what we can find. Start it with Outlaws. How are you doing tonight, Colossus of Akros? Start out with a foil, Pariah, Decimate, Steven Garment, Vault Board, Tyrant, Extended Mythic from the Big Score, and Honorary Tumblewag. Then we have a foil, Geared, Mirror of the Wilds, Extended Mythic. Electro Dominance, Thunderclap Drake, Riku of Many Paths, and Railway Brawler Foil Mythic. 
Holy cow, chat. We got a holy cow. I plan on watching the Fallout TV show. I could find some time. I would like to. Test control. Extended big score mythic. Endless detour. Dante borderless mythic. Gloomy Marsh borderless. And Bonnie Paul. Clear cutter. Let's leave these up. They'll open your two Double Masters 2022 collector pack. And then myth will be up. I uh, honestly, hopefully there's enough advertising to remind me this weekend to uh, watch it. Logan, thanks for subscribing. They start out with commons and uncommons. Then you get your borderless rule turf. Golgari rot farm. Seeker of the way. And Azorius chancery. Then we have four rares and mythics. Start out with a regular foil first. We have necrotic ooze. And we have a borderless non-foil, I think. Supreme Verdict. And then I think we have the Etched, if I remember right. We do. Bedlam Reveler. And last but not least, we have a rare Bloom Tender borderless foil for pack one. Really fun time playing Commander last night. Bit tired. We got home at 11.30. Couldn't fall asleep. Gotcha. Yep. Sometimes it's hard to go to sleep. Unearth. Mentor of the meat. Unearth again and foil. Is it Boilerworks? Gifts ungiven for your first rare. Borderless Phyrexian Altar. Very nice. And we have an etched rare Restoration Angel. And a borderless foil. The Dalkin Ori. Beautiful card. We'll get those sleeved up for you, Matthew. Thank you so much for grabbing some packs. Thank you, 570 MTG. Appreciate it. Aid, how you doing tonight? Uh, it is 8.43 p.m. here. Be streaming for a few hours. Let's see where we're at, chat. Uh, we need one more person for Collector Battle 2. Three more people for Play Battle 2. That is our last Play Battle. We have one more Collector Battle after this. I'm doing well, Cade. A little tired, not going to lie. But I'm doing well. Uh, pack packages all day with orders. Uh, I am not going to be going to the pre-release because tomorrow I'll be packing orders all day and then I'll finally get to spend hopefully the evening with my family again for the second time in like a week and a half. Um, and then we just filled up the Outlaws Collector Battle 2, so I'm going to put that on the schedule. Um, after that, Saturday, during the day, I'll be tra training. 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 I'll be training. I'll be training Queen Honey uh, for hopefully her last uh, training stream. So should be uh, should be fun. Isaac, you are in. I think you did. You did. Yeah, you're in. Hold on. Your name card's going to show up as Noblesville. But you are in... One, two, three... You're in Battle 2, Isaac. Stephanie, Isaac, Seth, Odious Cards, and Jennifer are in Battle 2 for Collectors. So here we go. Myth, good luck. I think she should be good, uh, Kate. She's been doing a great job. Um, we haven't had a Saturday stream in like two or three weeks though, so that's why I want to make sure we give her time to get back into the groove. Pillage the Bog, Force of Vigor, Mythic, nice. Elemental Eruption, Outcast of Trailblazer, and Magda, the Horde Master. We're trying to figure out, I'm going on uh, Alaska Cruise in May, and Queen Honey's going to be filling in uh, for a little bit. So... Uh, Pitiless Carnage, full extended. Bedevil, lock and load. Hair of the Peaks, very nice mythic myth. I know it's red. I know you don't like red, but, you know, sometimes that's how it goes. And you got loot, the key to everything. Queen Honey would be losing it right now. There you go, mess. We'll get those sleeved up for you. Got some fun mythics. Yeah, she'll do great. She's been doing great. Want to make sure that after the break that She's still comfortable before uh, we just say go for it. But especially by the time we go, I'm going on that Alaska cruise in May. She'll be, uh, I don't know if she'll be doing every stream I would normally do. She's, I think, 
We're still figuring out the schedule, but we're going to make it work. Uh, we need four more people to join Ryan in Outlaws Collector Battle 3. Highland up next. I think a lot of people like loot, yeah. You have working and have other obligations, I understand. I know how that goes, believe it or not. Highland, good luck. Three, six, eight, and two. Hope life's been treating you well. Do we get right now with the foil planes and Frasca joins up for your first rare. Monkzilla in chat. How you doing, Monkzilla? Thanks for joining us. We get less harassing than me. Hopefully. Archimedes just newt rare. I know y'all pretty good, but sometimes the internet sarcasm doesn't come through super well when you're new. Uh, Campbell Profiteering Mayor. Pretty cool train engine. I didn't realize how ornate it was after just seeing it on the uh, on the uh, borderless land cards. Because you're the boss and life is short. I hear you. Enjoy. Inspiring Vantage Rare. Shoot the Sheriff. High Noon Rare. I'm curious. I don't expect there to be many right now, but this is your uh, first time ever in the stream. Just say hey in chat. Would love to uh, see who's new here tonight. Void Rend and Annie joins up for a double rare pack. Down to our last couple play packs here. We have ooh, a special guest. Desert. Very nice. Very cool art on that. Fire Bluff Canal Borderless. ACAK, thank you for subscribing. Etherton. How you doing? Be an Ace Magic Corner. Good to see you. Archimedes Charm for a rare. Nice. Also getting Decimate Rare and Colossal Rattle Worm. Those are your play packs. I think we should be good to open the collectors and sleeve everything together, but we'll see. Um, so collector boosters should be the same everywhere printed in Japan. There's a slight reverse curl, but it's very slight. Path to Exile, Foil Rare, Unlicensed Hearse, Heartless Conscription, Rush of Dread, and Claim Jumper for pack one. What's, uh, best waifu, how you doing? Good luck on your battle, Ryan. Yeah, the wanted posters look cool. Foil, Crackle with Power. Vanishing Verse. Vengeful Growth. Umari Vault. Big score Mythic in the Vault frame. Very nice. And Ariat the Beguiler for your last rare there, Kylan. Thank you so much for grabbing some packs. Going to get these sleeved up for you. What's, uh, what's the quality issue on Collector Booster Foils? It's kind of hard to identify an issue if I don't know what the issue is. Uh, Alfonso up next in the Lord of the Rings Special Edition Collector Pack. Good luck. These are so much fun to open, but they are getting so hard and so expensive to find. Ridiculous. Sacrifice for the Glory Tower. Here we go, Alfonso. Lord of the Rings Special Edition, Silver Foils, Swamp, Relic of Sauron, Silver Foil, Mithril Coat, that's pretty nice. Aragorn, Hornburg, Hero, Scene, Mythic, Order of the Mark, Surge Rare, and Baradur, Borderless Surge Rare Land, with a Silver Foil, Tempt with Discovery. Get those sleeved up, Alfonso. AC, up next. And then after this, I think I have to start making name cards again. Uh, 
Okay, so we have Casey getting five Carl of Manor play packs for nineteen ninety nine, limit one per person per stream. Also have a separate special for RVR draft packs for Evan Curry Mastered for nineteen ninety nine, limit one per person per stream, and two Outlaws collector packs. Good luck, Casey. The played wide on the edges, peely looking. Yeah. I don't watch a ton of movies, unfortunately. Alex's Volt Strider Mythic and Cryptic Coat. Nice. I mean, you can watch any of our videos. We, uh, Ride the Whole Clad Mythic, Meticulous Archive Rare. I haven't seen any of those issues. Maybe they got a bad batch. I don't know. I, uh,. Franco, Baron of Tin Street, ever since everything went streaming, it's gotten kind of hard to find stuff on a lot. What's my favorite set in recent times? Uh, it's generally the newest set that's the most fun for me to open. Yaris, Roar of the Old Gods, the one I've opened the least of so far. Crime Novelist. Um, Lord of the Rings was pretty cool. Fallout was really fun. There just wasn't a lot of it. Um, but Mystery Key from the list. Expedited Inheritance. Foil Mythic. Honey Bone Brute Rare. Outlaws has been really fun to open. It's cool that there are multiple chases to go after. Um, a lot of the cards seem really strong. Seems like a fun set. Old Border Crypt Gas. Eldraine. Wilds of Eldraine or Throne of Eldraine, Isaac? There have been... Two in my recent magic memory. Warrant Warden. Wilds was alright to open. It's a fun set, but at least when it first came out, like nobody really cared about the confetti pools. Have a serial bobblehead coming Monday. Nice. Congrats. Mayhem Devil Old Border. Ral Zarek Borderless Mythic. Last Raven Crew Mastered here. Prolov was fun to draft. I think this will be. Fun to draft as well, Summer Boys. Uh, Ilharg, the Race Boar Mythic. Nice. Mythics are always fun. Uh, let's leave these and we'll open your two collector pack. Aftermath Analyst is almost two bucks. That's crazy. I feel like at this point, everybody just needs to go through their Karlov Manor bulk. Always look through your commons and uncommons from that set. There's so much value. Great train heist. Overwhelming Forces Mythic from the Breaking News Sheet. Reprint from Portal Three Kingdoms. We Ride at Dawn. Fortune Little Steed. And a Lost Jitte. Foil Big Score Mythic. Very nice. I wonder if that one seems to be holding value early just because it has the name Jitte in it. Or if it's actually going to be good. Bloomborough is going to be super hype. I think MH3 is going to be really good too. A lot of really powerful cards is what I'm expecting. Free Strider Lookout, Void Ren, Savvy Trader, Roxanne, and Frasca, the Silencer Mythic. There you go. Casey will get this sleeved up. Uh, Jacob, up next. But first, chat, I have to make a bunch of name cards, get uh, things ready for battles. Currently, chat for battle spots. We have two spots left in Outlaws Collector Battle 3. Three spots left in Outlaws Play Battle 2. But first, name cards. If you have any questions, let me know. Tick tock, tick tack. How you doing? Thanks for stopping by. Uh, my name is Lance Cawthorn. I'm the host here at Rip and Ship by Moonshot this evening. We normally stream Monday and Thursday at 30 Eastern Time. Or I do. Uh, Queen Honey will be streaming on Saturday at one o'clock eastern so that's gonna be fun um what else chat everything opened up tonight we pay for shipping this week we got shipped out on thursday the 18th unheimlich thank you for following getting us closer to our goal over on twitch 730 followers it was no 740 followers is what we're going for um, if you want to participate in the stream, we'd love to have you. We ship to the United States only, so unfortunately, international 
folks can't participate. Um, shipping is $6 for up to nine packs, $10 for up to a 500 count box. You can buy packs at moonshotgamestore.com slash live, battles at moonshotgamestore.com slash battle. Battle doesn't fill up tonight. We have up to 14 days to fill it. Um, what else? There was something else. Anything that is not on one of the two pages linked at the top of chat, it's in the pinned comment. If you want to buy stuff, anything else gets shipped sealed, has separate shipping charges. So keep that in mind. So for battles, the way it works is uh, you get to keep everything in the packs you open. You get a certain number of packs based on the battle. We add up the uh, mana values. All the rares and mythics according to our rules, which are slightly different than the uh, technical mana value rules. So make sure you read those on our battle page. The person with the highest total mana value of all the rares and mythics and the lowest total mana value of all the rares and mythics wins the applicable prize. So it's based off mana values. A good question, especially for new people. So we're almost done making name cards here, chat. Then all I have to do is get people in the right battles and make sure everything's in the right order. That will be open and packed. Okay. So, look at battles first. Make sure we get everybody in the right battle. This is Jacob. He's gonna be in battle one. Pretty sure Jacob filled up that battle. Jacob did fill up that battle. Then we have. Uh, Stephanie, who's going to be in battle one and two, so I need to print another card for that. Also important note, chat, you can only have one spot per person, per five person battle. You can be in multiple battles uh, of the same type. You just can't have two spots in the same battle. Two. Uh, and then we have Isaac getting a battle one. Boyd getting a battle two. Seth getting a battle one. Then we have Odious cards getting both, so we gotta make a card for that. Uh, so it's not technically free. Battle does cost more than just buying the packs on your own. So there is cost included on that. Just to be perfectly clear, we take the box price and divide it by the number of people in the battle uh, to determine the battle prices. One and two. And then Jennifer getting in battle one. I think that fills up battle two for battle one, right? It does, great. Uh, was that five people? It is, perfect. And then Ryan getting in battle one. Odie's cards getting in battle one again. Stephanie getting in battle one. Uh, Jacob's getting in two battles, and Jenks getting in battles. So we're sold out of collector battles right now, chat. And I need to get... Uh, 
another collector battle on the schedule. So one is just the battle type, it's either a collector battle or a play battle. It's not the number collector battle you're in. So it's a number one collector battle, number two play battle. Just so I make sure we open the right type of box. We're getting there, chat. All these battles do add time. That's why we uh, don't do battles during the first few days of a set. We don't have time. Uh, so Jacob's getting into battle one and battle two. And then Jank is in battle one. is the third battle one and then sean is in battle two we need one more person for outlaws play battle two definitely uh willing to add some more battle spots after a little bit so if you're looking for a battle just be aware of that we might add some more later but uh we're just sticking with these for now Let's get this order right. We already opened Casey. Jacob's up next. We have our collector battle and our play battle one. Then we have Jeff, David, Jonathan, Eric. Then we have collector battle two. Then we have Ryan, Logan, Chris. A lot of Jacobs tonight, chat. We have Jacob S, and then Jacob M, and this first Jacob is Jacob M. Then we have, after that, we're going to have Collector Battle 3. We got all the battles going, chat. We only need one more person for Play Battle 2. That currently has Sean, Jacob, Odious Cards, and Boyd in it. The Boyd, Odious Cards, Jacob and Sean are battle two. Need one more person for that. So, chat, here we go. Yeah, we got a lot of Jacobs tonight. Collector battle three on the schedule now. Love to see it. Got one other thing to double check and then we'll get going. Yeah, so the way you change your name to your stream name is if you want to do that when you're filling out the, uh, if you watch the exclamation point new. Cryptic, thanks for the prime sub. Appreciate you. If you watch the new person video exclamation point new, it'll show you. But when you're filling out the, uh, the shipping address, there's a company name field. You can put your stream name there and then it'll overwrite your real name for your name card. I'll still know it's you because the backside will have your name on it. But the, uh, the name card will just have on the front your stream name. So we just filled uh, the play battle. So I'm going to put that on the schedule too. So kind of worked out while we were getting all that admin work done. We filled up all the battles. we do still have plenty of packs in stock for anybody who wants some as long as we can ship to you so jacob m in the commander master set six outlaws play uh raven curry master collector and four draft We go good luck jacob yeah those lord of the rings packs are uh they're getting super expensive but they are super fun
Hypothesizzle and Caustic Bronco for pack one. Thank you, Sarah. Soak Sphinx Rare. Everybody in chat, I want you to know that Sarah is the one who ships all your stuff. So everybody needs to say in chat, thank you, Sarah. Reads Gambit, Big Score, Mythic, and Kiln joins up rare. Carl also helps get your stuff ready to be packed up and shipped out. So big thank you to Carl and Sarah for all the hard work they've been doing over this last week. Much appreciated. Alfonso, you are in Collector Battle 1. How's work if you order some right now while I join? Yes, you'll be on this queue. You'll be at the bottom of the queue down here. Ice Black T. Welcome to the stream. If you have any questions, let us know. Final Showdown Mythic. It's going to be a fun one. You can type exclamation point new in chat and it explains how everything works too. Ice Black T. So. Uh, three steps ahead, rare. <laughs> Good luck, Jank. I don't think that's possible. Spark double borderless. We'll send it in spirit. How about that? And then you'll get it normal time. They do do a great job. Thank you all so much for all the kind words. The deck bedazzle. There's a lot that goes on behind the scenes that y'all don't see, though. It's a lot of work from the whole team. Life from the loam, old border rare. Why is there? Was it just? It's supposed to be. Gonna count these packs, make sure we got you the right number around the Kree Master. I feel like we've only opened two draft packs. I might have miscounted there. Probably did. Kaya rare. Let's go back and check. That or I'm just, no, we got the right number. We got the Bedeck Bedazzle and the Spark Double. Yep, yeah, okay. We're right. My brain's just fried. What a moment this time and Carl's not here. The good thing, Sarah. We can show him the replay. Uh, the textured foil, ooh, land tax mythic, Inferno Titan, Yasan, and Tooth and Nail Borderless. What a great setback. Bastion of Remembrance 2, Sky Shroud Claim, and Nadir's Nightblade Borderless. Uh, the textured foils come in at a little above 1% pull rate. They're the Breaking News Mythics, and they look very, very, very cool. And then there are five cards from the big score in the raised vault frame it's kind of like gilded foil from nuka penna and uh those are like 0.44 percent pull rate based on what we've done so far to do a video so the problem with the video is we don't want to like expose customer information so there's a lot of customer information all over the place when we're like working with stuff Aurelia Exemplar Justice, Foil Old Border Mythic, Temple Garden, Borderless Shock, Rakdos Old Border Rare, and Thrash Threat, Foil Rare. I thought about taking some pictures today, but everybody's names and addresses were everywhere. So it's just kind of like, yeah, I don't want I don't want to put that out there for everybody. Exactly, Jank. You gotta figure it out. You're not allowed to open that if your name is Kraken Jank. One day you will though, and then you'll have to change your name. Jacob, hope you enjoyed your packs. Thank you so much for grabbing them. Uh, Outlaws Collector Battle. Let's go. So I'm just going to make sure we have this right. Uh, we have Odious Cards. We have Alfonso. Well, let me actually get the cards out, I guess. We have Odious Cards, Alfonso. Uh, we have Jusu, Island, and Jacob. Good luck to y'all. I'll make sure it's Jacob M too, because there, a lot of, it's a lot of Jacobs here tonight, right? Yeah. The other night it was Justin's. Tonight it's Jacobs. This is how the battles work. 
I'll explain it as we go. We start by getting a collector box. Kylan's going to be going first. Good luck, Kylan. Good these cards. Good luck to everybody, obviously. I want you all the great greats, so. though. Alfonso, Dusu, and Jacob. We got everybody on there. Got a collector box. We open it up. We shuffle the pack. And we roll dice to see which side of the uh, stack of packs we take your cards from. The odds left, evens right. We always pass the cards out left to right. We open the packs. You get to keep everything in your packs. You get two packs each for this battle. Count the converted mana value, rares, and mythics. Person with the highest total gets extra pack. Person with the lowest total gets extra pack. If there's a tiebreaker, eight from the right. If there's a tiebreaker. We'll explain how that works when we get there. But know that the rules are predetermined and listed on our website item description. So, Kylan up first. Here we go. What do we find? These battles have been really fun. Some of them have been super close, others not so much. I'll uh, get a better feel tonight as we go through these. Starting now with the Hellspur Posse Boss for four. Cruel Ultimatum for seven. Mana value is so big that they had to move the Prosperity Post off center. Uh, Sand Scout for two. Generous Plunder Big Score Mythic for two. And Inspiring Vantage for zero. Started strong and then slid way down. So maybe you're going for the low spot. So we're at 15 right now. On to pack two for Kylan. We're starting out here with an even interrupter for three. Pest infestation for one. Forger's foundry for three. Rakdos, the muscle. These uh, mana values aren't in the normal spot. They're down the side here, so that's five. And then Colossal Rattle Worm for four. So let's see where you end up. Four and seven's 11. I think that was a two, but let's double check. 11, 13, 15, 19, 20, 23, 26, and five is 31. So five, eight, nine, 12, 16, 18, 20, 27, 31 for Kylan. What are these cards up next? See where 31 ends. Sometimes it's the right spot, sometimes it's not. I remember there was one set where everybody always got like 42 or 41. Tomorrow, Yeehaw Brazil. Fun. Starting out, Odious Cards with Imps Mischief for two. Villainous Wealth for three. Crackling Spell Slinger for five. It's going to be a fun card, chat. Greed Scambit, Vault Frame, Big Score Mythic for four. And Key to the Vault for two. Swamp. Prairie Dog Squirrel go high we can definitely try you're at 16 right now pest infestation for one dust bowl for zero high is not looking good Rainfire, thanks for the bit appreciate you dune chanter for three laughing jasper flint for three and jace reawaken for two so maybe low maybe low uh, 2, 6, 11, 14, 16, 17, still 17, 20, 23, 25. So yeah, you're definitely going low, Odious Cards. Hopefully that works out for you. Alfonso up next. Appreciate everybody hanging out tonight. Uh, we're sold out of battles for the moment. I might add some more later tonight. Uh, we do still have plenty of collector packs and play packs available. Alfonso, here you go. Uh, yes, so they're all printed in Japan, which means the rarest mythics are in the front. At least the ones we have. Morbid Opportunist, Spoil Special Guest Mythic for three. For Alfonso, beautiful art on that. Ionize for three. Card Grave Crawler for you guessed it, three. Braska joins up for not three, better known as two. And Kellen joins up back to the three train. So you're at 14 on that pack, Alfonso. I rain fire. Uh, do I think somebody got upset about that? Probably not. But maybe. Archangel of Ties Mythic for four. Bell the Mighty for five. Yuma for eight. Borderless Mythic. Yeah, that's eight. Great Train Heist for one. 
And Oko, full mythic for four. See where you're at, Alfonso. I have no clue. Uh, so three, six, nine, twelve, fourteen, eighteen, twenty-three, thirty-one, thirty-two, and four is thirty-six. So five, ten, thirteen, eighteen, twenty-two, twenty-five. 27, 30, 36 for Alfonso. Unfortunately, putting Kylan in the middle. Jusu up next. You think so, uh, Colossus? You wouldn't have printed the card just because, because it was off center. Jusu up next. Good luck, Jusu. Yeah, you will, Jank, for sure. Or just like, yeah, you will. Generous Plunder or Full Big Score Mythic for two. Void Slime for three. Power Winder for two. A lot of people really high on this card. Other people think it's junk. We'll see. Frying Vantage for zero. And Arc Mage's Newt for two. So pretty low pack there. You're at nine after pack one. Odious Cards is shaking in his boots. Monster Hunter set. Uh, I think Final Fantasy is going to be pretty good. Braska joins up for two. Imp's Mischief for two. Going super low. Rachi Soul Reaver for six. That hurts. Not going to lie. Final Showdown. Mythic for one. That helps. And Breaches for three. This is going to be close, chat. Going to be close. We have three, four, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 23. Two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. 19 20 23 so jusu taking the low spot sorry odious cards jacob last but not least take this away from somebody else bonzo in the high spot right now good luck jacob star wars would be really sick for sure i think it'll happen one day Well, I think it's impossible to know all the art out there and know whether somebody copied somebody else. That's just an obscene requirement. Cruel Ultimatum for seven. Grindstone for one. Artless Conscription for eight. So you're definitely going high. Flickshot Show Off for two. And Breast in Peace, Big Score Mythic for two. Pack two for Jacobs here at seven, eight, 16, 18, 20 after pack one. Star Wars does have its own card game, but so does Final Fantasy. So that's not really a great argument one way or another. Star Wars is actually another card game, but it's owned by Disney, which has its own card game, Lorcana. So Dillis Mine 2, Mana Drain. Very nice for another two. Congrats. Vihan, Gold Waker for three. Uh, Key to the Vault for two. And Selvala, Mythic for four. I don't think we got high enough there, unfortunately. But we will double check. So 2, 10, 12, 13, 20, 22, 24, 26, 30, 33. So unfortunately did not quite get there, Jacob. But you got some great cards. Congrats on your pulls. Alfonso getting the high. Jisoo getting the low. Congrats to you both. Alfonso's getting the dice roll. Odds left, evens right for your pack. Then we always open the low spots back first. 18, right pack for Alfonso, left pack for Jusu. Jusu, good luck. There are a lot of really cool cards in this set, Jank. Uh, Transmutation font, big score, full extended mythic, unlicensed hearse, arcane heist, concealed courtyard, borderless, and caustic bronco. We will get those with the rest of your cards, Jusu. Congrats. I mean, Lord of the Rings had a TCG at one point. It failed, but they had one. So Warhammer has a not a card game, but its own very intricate game. So, I mean, these days people just seem to care about licensing fees. A Coolie Unrepentant, Void Ren, Poetic Charge, World Walker Helm, Extended Mythic, and Serific Steed for Alfonso. We'll get those sleeved up and put the rest of these cards with yours. Thank you all so much for battling. Collector Battle 1 is in the books. Going to put these cards away. And then we have Play Battle 1 right after this. Uh, the, men or the menu. The uh, schedule does go off the screen chat. But the good news is you can see the full schedule 
by typing exclamation point schedule in chat. Um, it does not update like the main schedule does. So you just have to look and see where we're at on the schedule. Right now we're at OTJ Play Battle 1. Find that. That's where we're at. And then you can figure out how far down the list you are from there. Then why is there a Star Wars card game right now that's not run by Disney? I just like... They're, do they're literally doing it right now. Okay, so we have Play Battle 2. In this one, we have uh, Odious Cards. Who else is in this one? MTG Cards in Review, Brandy, Julian, and Stephanie. Good luck, y'all. Yeah, and Marvel's for Magic, which is going to be massive, and that's Disney as well. I think Fallout was extremely popular. I don't think that was a mistake at all. It also ties them all with the TV show, so I think they were really smart about that. I think that was a smart business move by all parties involved. Okay, so here we go. Good luck, everybody. This is a play battle, so it's going to be a play box instead of a uh, collector box this time. In this battle, each person gets six packs, and the high and low gets three packs. There are definitely some people hyped about Duskmorn. Um, I definitely get a lot more people hyped about Bloomborough, but you're definitely not alone. I've seen several people say they're excited about it. I think the value in Fallout Boosters is there because there were so few Fallout Boosters. If they had printed that as much as a normal set, I wonder if the alternate arts and stuff would still hold the same value. Andre is all Cryptic cares about. Uh, we can't get enough Star Wars Unlimited, Brett. So... They, uh, it's extremely tight supply. When we get it, it sells. From what I understand. I'm not involved on that side of the business, but that's what I've heard. Odds left, evens right. Five from the left. Six prize packs. Julian up first. Gone within 48 hours. That's what I thought, Sarah. Julian up first. Here we go. I mean, it's a sign of a popular card game. So hopefully they can keep it up, right? Railway Brawler Mythic for pack one. Start with five. It's always fun when it's the new card game. It's like in three years, will people still be playing it? That's the question, right? Goldcrack for two, Marchesa for three. Game is really good. Glad to hear it. Hopefully they can keep it interesting and make expansions without breaking the game. Hitless Carnage for four, foil rare. Archmage's Newt for two. I've heard good things about it. We have people that are excited to play it, so it's an exciting time. Iowa Keen for two. So overall, you haven't gotten anything super crazy high mana value wise, but at the same time, you're not getting a bunch of land. So we're just gonna have to see, wait and see how this plays out. Full Campbell for three, Surgical Extraction for one, and another round for three. But you are getting a lot of rares. So hopefully, Ends up working out for you. What do you mean? Uh, no OG reprint the OG Eldraine set. 
Have to excel for one and Malcolm for two. That is it. I don't have to lose So here we go. We have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight for Julian. Stephanie up next. Oh, print an L drain set. Gotcha. I read reprint. That's my bad. I'm just tired. Um, there will eventually be a time where they push the power level too far again. It's happened multiple times in the past, and it'll happen again. They're not perfect. Hopefully, it's a long time before it happens, but it'll happen. Scape shift, special guest mythic for four. Giza mythic for five. Uh, there's like something going on in the top left hand corner of that card. Not sure if that's like extra print or scratch or what, but just so you're aware, uh, Stephanie, if you feel it's damaged, you can always file a compensation request with wizards or replacement request. I think is what it's called. And, uh, they may ask for you to send it in, but they'll replace it for a contagion engine mythic for six stinger back terror for four. So it seems like you're going high here so far based on what we've seen. You're already at 19 after two packs. And how's it going? Uh, Territory Forge, big score mythic for five and Campbell for three. We still have three packs left. Crazy. We're sold out of battles right now. So tour the infiltrator. You know, chat, it's that that foil thing again. These are foil dots all over the top of this card. I don't know how foil is ending up all over the card. It is a non-foil card. But that's what it is. I don't understand it, but it's weird. Uh so that's for two. I, I don't know what's going on there. Strange. I saw it in some other packs the other day. I don't know if it's just our play boxes or what. We might add some more battles later tonight. Although, ooh, you got a bow token. Very nice. Bruce Tarl for four. Um, and Vadmir for two. I think we'll probably do more battles on Monday. Queen Honey doesn't do battles. Um, I'll be honest. I don't want to mess up counting. Roll ultimatum for seven. Great train heist for one. Um, I'm feeling fine to count now, but it's been a long week, so probably going to leave the battles where they're at for tonight, and then we'll do more on Monday. Uh, but let's math this real quick. We have 4, 9, 15, 19, uh, 24, 27, 29, 33, 35, 42, 43 for Stephanie. Wow, that is, uh, that is pretty high. 43, MTG Cards in Review up next. Confetti foil. Maybe, maybe. Nice. Well, I hope you enjoy your lunch break and have a good rest of your shift. Yeah, there have been some really high play battles. You get so many rares in these. Tarnation Vista. What in Tarnation chat for zero? Elsewhere Posse Boss for four for pack one. Uh, Bonnie Paul for six. Too bad the bow token was uh, with Stephanie. Didn't get the uh, bow Bonnie Paul combo. Bubble tip lost on the range for three. I think we'd be excited to pull that one later. Appreciate everybody hanging out. We have 167 people watching. Pillage the bog for two. If you get a chance to gently tap the like button, we'd appreciate it. Helps us out more than you know. We're not even to 50 likes yet. Ideally, we'd like to get to 100, but 50 is the first goal, so take it one step at a time. Once we get to 100, we get to press the e haw button on the soundboard. That's always fun. Siphon Insight for two and High Noon for two. 
Got the Roadrunner. There's a Coyote card too that the art combines on, which is pretty fun. Uh, I don't remember, Ken. We might have the other day. Reckless Power Mythic for two. Grand Abolisher Mythic for two. And Inspiring Vantage with the foil dots at the top for zero. The weird foil dots. Not sure what's going on there, but I don't know if maybe like a sticker sheet disintegrated or what, but uh, we have four, 10, 13, 15, 17, 19, 21, 23. Wow, very low. Three, or sorry, two, four, six, eight, 10, 13, 19, 23. It is 23 for MTG cards in review. Unfortunately, Julian, that's going to knock it in the middle. Odious cards up next. Black odious cards. Here we go. We got the 50 likes. Thank you all so much. That's the animus for two. So the reason why I ask for likes is because as a YouTuber myself, I never remember to like a stream until somebody asked me to. But that like count actually helps YouTube know how engaged people are in the stream. Girid, Mirror of the Wilds, Mythic for three, and Wily Duke for three. And uh, helps let YouTube know that, you know, engaging streams, they generally push them out to more people. So definitely helps the channel out. Definitely appreciate all the help from y'all. It's free. It doesn't cost anything. Pretty quick and easy thing to do. Spire Bluff, Canal for zero, Foil Rare, and Tiny Bones joins up for one. And it helps out a lot. So thank you all so much for doing that. Just do it when you start a video now. That's awesome. I try to remember to do that, but I forget so many times. Annie joins up for four. And I find myself, even like my favorite streamers, like they're streaming and then they ask, I'm like, crud, I haven't done that yet. So that's the only reason why I mention it throughout the stream, because I figure most people like me and just forget. Best infestation for one, and Vraska joins up for two. These, uh will be available for pickup tomorrow but if you are coming to the store for pickup please just let us know ahead of time uh because outlaws merriment for four and memory vessel big score mythic for five Ooh, and gold Vein hydra for one uh, we usually pack up cards once a week so we would have to uh find your cards and get them packed up for you to be able to pick them up they won't be uh packed up until tuesday so so for Odie's cards, we have 2, 5, 8, 9, 13, 14, 15, 16, 20, 25, 26, 6, 10, 12, 13, 17, 18, 21, 24, 26. So unfortunately, it ended up in the middle. You did get some pretty fun cards there. Got some Mythics. Gold Vein Hydra looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, we'll get those with the rest of your cards. And Brandy is up next. But if you are coming to pick your stuff up, just shoot us an email, either lance at moonshotgamestore.com or support at moonshotgamestore.com, or you can copy both of us. The Devil for three and Colossal Rattleworm. That way we can make sure we get your stuff together for you. Back to you for Brandy. Nice. Thank you. Earth of Joe. Nexus of Becoming, big score, Mythic for six, and Pitiless Carnage Rare for four. We're going pretty high there. Out of those first couple packs, you're already at 17. Uh, concealed Courtyard for zero is going to hurt a lot because 43 is a very high number to get to, Brandy. You could get a bunch of lands and slow way down and grab the low, or just go for some really bomby cards. Fell the Mighty for five, Roxanne for five. Well, make it a honest attempt here we're 27 now if i remember right two packs left yeah 10 20 we're 27 right now electro dominance for two and smuggler surprise for one so that puts us to 30 you would need a massive massive last pack here not impossible but nice isaac pre-releases do take a long time you have to build your deck Oko, the ringleader mythic for four. Fun mythic, congrats. 
Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't get you to the high spot. 4, 5, 6, 7, 17, 21, 27, 31, 34. But uh, Oko, one of the cards people are looking for in this set. So congrats on that. We'll get those sleeved up. Stephanie and MTG cards in review getting high and low respectively. That means Stephanie's getting the dice roll. Odds left, evens right. Yeah, pre-releases take a long time. Just kind of nature of the beast. So we got a five left three packs for Stephanie, right three for MTG cards in review. Always open the low spot first. You got to build your deck and then you have multiple rounds and uh, everybody's reading the cards for the first time. So the games take a while. Vaultborn Tyrant, Big Score, Mythic, and Jace reawakened double Mythic with Magda. That was, uh, that was a pretty cool pack. Carl, how you doing? You missed it earlier. Everybody said thank you for helping get everything ready to get packed up and shipped out. Insatiable Avarice. It was pretty cool. Sarah was here. Or Sarah still is here. That Sarah was here earlier as well. So. Uh, Generous Plunder, Big Score Mythic, and Key to the Vault. There you go, MTG cards and review. We'll get those sleeved up. For now, yeah. There's probably going to be going to bed soon, I'd imagine. Got to get up early and pack more boxes, and I'm going to get up as soon as I can force myself out of bed to come pack more boxes tomorrow as well. Thanks for all your help today, Sarah. Botanical Sanctum and one last job for Stephanie's first pack. Two more to go. So after this, we have uh, some packs for four different people. Then we have Collector Battle 2. Uh, Obeka Rare. Unfortunately, chat, I've decided that I'm not going to add any more battles tonight just because I want to make sure that my brain is sharp enough to count. And, uh, ooh, Bow Token. Nice. So he didn't, or no, you just got two bow tokens. Bruce Tarl Rare. Uh, MTG Cards and Review got the uh, the Bonnie Paul. Well, sometimes that's how it goes. But Stephanie, thank you so much for battling. We'll get those put away for you. Gotcha, Isaac. Sorry about that. Uh, but that's the cool thing about YouTube is we have that rewind feature. So you can definitely catch it after if you need to. But please be safe and... Don't don't rip and ship and drive. Not a good combo. You could put like Bluetooth audio on if you wanted to and listen like it's a radio show. I do read all the card names off the Rare Mythic. But uh that's your call. Uh summer UPS, summer USPS. Depends on weight and location and like twelve bajillion other factors. But some are UPS, some are USPS. Uh, Jeff, up next, getting a collector pack. Outlaws. Doing the thing. Pack. Good luck, Jeff. Yeah, you did pass Moonbot. I forgot what you did, but you, you ranked up. Hell to pay, full extended. Commandeer rare. Greywater's Fixer, Satoru the Infiltrator, one imposter. Ooh, and a full mythic Tiny Bones. Very nice. A lot of people excited about Tiny Bones. David going to be up next. David R getting two collector packs. We do still have plenty of packs available if anybody wants to grab some. We have everything that we have in stock up on the website, so we're not limited to just Outlaws anymore. Uh, if we sell out of anything outlaws let us know we'll definitely be doing more battles monday queen honey when she streams on uh saturday does not do battles yet probably won't be doing battles for a while while she gets comfortable streaming endless detour full of rare endless detour still going in circles somewhere but it's not the right way arcane heist lost jitte extended mythic very nice and great train heist on to uh pack two here for david Starting out with Insatiable Avarice, Abrupt Decay, Thunderclap Drake, Bibblethip, Lost on the Range, and Marchesa, Dealer of Death. We'll get those sleeved up for you, David. Appreciate you grabbing some packs. 
just a reminder chat these are technically pre-sales you could pick them up tomorrow if you're local uh but nothing from tonight will ship until thursday the 18th um and that's if you pay for shipping this week if you don't pay for shipping this week then and this week by this week i mean starting tonight through monday stream you can combine all your orders from tonight's stream saturday stream and monday stream under one shipping payment as long as you stay under the shipping limit uh, but you have to pay for shipping this week the shipping week to get your stuff set we have jumpstart 22 and four outlaws collector packs for jonathan good luck what's good opening magic packs what's not good the metal worker gotcha Detective with Shimmer Dragon and an anime magnifying glass. On your collector packs. So big game synergy and everybody else, please do not look at the Shopify app for shipments. Um, we do not use Shopify for shipments. We mark the orders fulfilled after we open them so that um, we can manage our business as you can imagine with hundreds of rip and ship orders over the last few days if we left all those unfulfilled we would not be able to see what really needs to be fulfilled laughing jasper flint illness wealth back in town hell to pay and roxanne so uh, don't pay attention to shopify app it's wrong you will get an email from i don't know what the email is um it's from us and Pirate Ship. Pirate Ship's the uh, mailing company we use. Foil Void Rend, Contagion Engine, nice mythic. Dream Thief, Spandana, Marchesa, and Transmutation Font, big score mythic. You'll get an email with a tracking number from us through Pirate Ship uh, when your order goes out. 50 you spend on packs weekend, should go bundle or two collector packs. Do you want more cards or do you want shiny things? Ancient Cornucopia, Extended Foil, Big Score Mythic, Archmage's Charm, Stell Lee, Borderless Mythic, Grisly, Bill, Spine Sower, Extended Mythic, and Botanical Sanctum. One more pack for you here. Mountain Dew, exactly. Yeah, Pirate Ship's great. Makes shipping stuff easy. Foil Double Down, Extended Mythic, Collective Defiance, Arachi Soul Reaver, Tiny Bones joins up, and another round. There you go, Jonathan. Hope you enjoyed your packs. Can get these sleeved up? Wait till it's at the house and be surprised. That is one way to do it for sure. Uh, Eric up next, getting three more World Collector packs. Good luck, Eric. I will say it is a good idea to know when your packages are arriving just so they don't sit like on the front porch for an extended period of time, but nothing wrong with being surprised either. We have one, need two more. So when you get your tracking number, Mitch, it'll tell you whether it's UPS or USPS. So you will know ahead of time. So just keep an eye on your email for the tracking number. That's funny time or funny cryptic. Yeah, we tried to put a sticker in everyone. Uh, the way you add shipping is there's an item on our pack list. If you go to uh, moonshotgamestore.com slash live, go all the way to the bottom. There's an item called ship now. It costs one penny. Add that to your cart. That does not pay for shipping. All that does is enable you to pay for shipping. So you add that to your cart, you go to checkout, you get to the shipping screen. There's going to be either a drop down or radio button. 
It is $6 for up to nine packs. And it's ten dollars for up to a 500 count box so whichever one fits however many packs you got choose that one so it should either be 601 or 1001 plus if applicable for where you live sales tax um when you hit the pay button uh if you need that written down uh shoot me an email or support an email lance at moonshotgamestore.com or support at moonshotgamestore.com and we can uh send the written instructions for you Starting out with a foil anime bitter blossom. Beautiful card. Aggravated assault. Wow, double anime. Restless Fortress. Yenna. And foil mythic virtual loyalty. That was a fun pack. Hello, myth. No problem. Happy to help. Uh, copy enchantment. Copy the copy enchantment. Horton Lock Whale. Imaday and the Pyre Hammer and Bramble Familiar. One more pack here for Eric. Good luck. Buzz, you like trading red cards for good blue cards, right? Uh, Tangled Colony. Regular Bitter Blossom. Pretty cool. Restless Bivouac. Misleading Signpost and Rankles Prank. So there you go, Eric. We'll get those sleeved up for you as well. Appreciate you grabbing some more packs. Uh, and up next, we have Collector Battle 2. Like I've mentioned a few times, we'll have more battles on Monday chat. Hopefully a lot more battles on Monday. Um, my brain's just not... Not in a math and mood right now. Happy to get these uh, original battles done for sure. But want to make sure that we're good. And we uh, count right, so... So in this one, we have Stephanie. We have Isaac. We have... Death, Odious Cards, and Jennifer. So let me get that taken care of on my end real quick. And then we'll run the second battle. Oh, good night, Silverback. Appreciate you. Get paid Monday? Nice. That's a good day then. There are five people. We're going to shuffle these up. Uh, if you're new, welcome to the stream. My name is Lance Cawthorn. I'm your Rip and Ship host this evening. I stream Monday and Thursday at 30 Eastern Time. Queen Honey streams Saturday at 1 o'clock Eastern. Well, this Saturday at 1 o'clock Eastern at least. Um, we're Moonshot Games at WPN Premium LGS in Noblesville, Indiana. Uh, you Anybody can get packs, but you do have to live in the U.S. Uh, for shipping purposes shipping six bucks for up to nine packs or ten dollars for up to a 500 count box and we ship out once a week our next shipping day will be on uh thursday next week 18 got everybody oh get there got everybody there we did it collector battle two Are you watching Fallout Myth? Or is or are you watching something else? Probably watching a live stream of like Critical Role or something. Yeah, it's totally fine as long as you use the same name and like email address and address and stuff. We just basically combine the orders and make sure they get to you. That's all. Uh, nice. That's exciting, Myth. Critical roll. Got there. Nice. Here we go. Collector Battle 2. I uh, will not be watching Fallout tonight. I don't think my wife would like that show. Otherwise, I'd try to get her to watch it. Here we go. Starting out with odious cards on the left. We're going to roll dice. 12. So packs are coming from the right. Always pass them out left to right. Good luck, everybody. Not pull the textured or raised foil yet tonight. So hopefully we get to one soon. 
Oh, it's not a dumb question at all. I'm glad you asked. There are a lot of people probably in the same situation. And uh, you ask and helps clear it up for everybody. Odious cards up first. Start with a foil area at the Beguiler for four. Surgical extraction for one. Cataclysmic prospecting for two. Badmere new blood for two. And smuggler's surprise for one. I almost call it smuggler's spree, but spree's the, uh, the name of the thing. Uh, we're not going to have any more battles tonight just because I am not in the best mathing form for the evening. Obeka for four. Fractured Identity for five. Discrete Retreat for four. Uh, Pest Control, Big Score Mythic for two. And Ancient Cornucopia, Big Score Mythic for three. I will have a bunch of battles on Monday. Queen Honey doesn't do battles yet. Um, I just, as it gets later in the night, I question my ability to properly count. So... Uh, Wanda posters are only foil, non foil. That's it. She beat you five times. That's crazy. That's awesome, though, because I think they have more fun when they win new players. You know, it's just like you don't want to just like eat a new player into the ground and then they never want to come back and play. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six, ten, fifteen, nineteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-eight. 10, 15, 19, 21, 24, 28. So four. 7, 9, 13, uh, 18, 22, 23, 24, 25, 6, 7, 28. So 28 for Odious cards starting us out here. Seems pretty low for Collector Battle. We'll see. Jennifer up next. Look, Jennifer. What well, I think the strongest color is in this set a loaded question in what regards but i don't have an answer for you no matter what but maybe chat will help uh ooh, full oko for three english to making so double mythic for threes each rumbleweed for 11 you are going high now malcolm wanted poster for two and molten duplication mythic for two so honestly well i don't know 11 makes it very hard to go low we'll just leave it at that Took a break after Throne of Eldraine came out. Step Between Worlds for five. Collective Defiance for three. Greywater's Fixer for four. Practice Joints Up for five. And Hell to Pay for one. So let's map chat. We have one, two, three, eight, twelve, fifteen, twenty, twenty two, uh, thirty three. 36, 39 for Jennifer. See if it's enough. Isaac up next. 39 seems respectable, but I think we've definitely been in the 40s before, so definitely not a lock. Isaac, here you go. Are you talking like constructed, standard, modern, pioneer, limited? There are so many ways to evaluate strength. Vaultborn Tyrant. Well, Mythic for seven. It is not the raised treatment style, unfortunately, Isaac. Path to Exile for one. Felix Five Boots for five. Properly costed. Elspur Posse Boss for four. And Riku of Many Paths for three. On to pack two. Yeah, wait till you see it in uh, Gilded Foil, the uh, raised foil. I'm back in Magic in October, start playing every day in 2011, stop around 2015. Yeah, Magic has a way of bringing you back. Terrific Steed for two, Archmage's Charm for three, Embrace the Unknown for three, another round for, you guessed it, three, and Bruce Tarl for not three, but four, but because we started with a two, it makes it 15. So four, seven, 10, 13, 15, 18, 22, uh, 27, 28, 28 and 7 is 35, which unfortunately puts you in the middle. Sorry, Isaac. Got some fun stuff, though. Stephanie up next. And then we have Seth last, but not least after that. Black looks really solid in this set, not Black Lotus Myth. Thought I was, uh, 
Yeah, it was not the raised foil, unfortunately. Foil, wanted poster Oko. This is a really hard pull. Congrats on that, Stephanie. A lot of people looking for that variant. That is for four. Skullcrack for two. Leyline Dowser for two. One last job for three. And double down, Mythic for four. So two Mythics in that pack, too, I think. No tiny bones. I'm sorry. Getting a specific mythic is really hard. What is this? Borderless foil, blooming marsh. That's what it is. Archive trap for five. Behan extended mythic foil for three. Honor temple wag for three. And Karvik the Punisher for three. So let's see where you end up. Uh, two, four. 7, 11, 16, 19, 22, 25, and 4 is 29. Bummer. So you're one off. We have 4, 7, 10, 13, 18, uh, 22, 25, 27, 29. So we'll recount Odious cards if we need to. Um, if Odious ends up being in the low spot, since you're one off, that's the rule. If you're one off, we do recount the other person just to make sure. Uh, but right now you're in the middle, Stephanie. Seth, last but not least. Sounds good, Myth. It was very close for sure. Chat, we have 180 people watching. Y'all are awesome. Thanks so much for joining us. Primal Command for five. Commandeer for seven for Seth. Smoldering Stagecoach for four. Pillage the Bog for two. Step between worlds for five. So odious cards not worried about Seth going low. That's for sure. Already at 5, 10, 17, 21, 23 after pack one. That's crazy. Got a chance for raise? Congrats. Surgical extraction for one. Outlaws Merriment for four. Dream Thieves Bandana for two. Calamity for six. And a cool the underpendant for four. Jennifer might be worried though. Let's see where we end up. We have 5, 10, 17, 21, 23, 24, 28, 30, 36, 40. Ooh, within one. 10, 12, 16, 17, 22, 24, 28, uh, 28, and 7 is 35, and 5 is 40. So Seth does have 40. Stephanie does have 29. We're going to have to recount Odious Cards and Jennifer. Uh, Odious Cards, if you have 28, you do get the low. And if Jennifer really has 39, then Seth gets the high. So let's start with Jennifer. Malcolm's cost is over here. 2, 3, 8, 12, 15, 20, 22, 33, 36, 39. So Jennifer, unfortunately, do end up in the middle. Uh, and then Odie's cards, if you have 28, you're in the low spot. 3, 4, 5 nine 14 18 19 21 23 24 24 and 4 is indeed 28 so odious cards does have the low spot sorry stephanie so seth getting the high spot and the dice roll odds left evens right uh six right back for seth left back for odious cards odious cards this is your pack yeah this battle is tight those battles are fun though makes it interesting uh, Vanishing Verse, Primal Command, Dead Before Sunrise, Torpor Orb, Extended Mythic, and Blooming Marsh for Odious Cards. We'll get those sleeved up. Thank you again for battling. Uh, and then we'll see what's in the last pack of the box for Seth. Good luck, Seth. We do still have packs available. We're sold out for battles for tonight. Helen joins up. Void Slime, Charred Grave Robber, Bruce Tarl, and High Noon. Uh, I just want to make sure that I count right, so I know I'll be good for like the next half hour, hour, but after that, it's a pretty big question mark since this will this is technically my seventh stream in eight days, so worked all day yesterday and today packing cards too, so very happy to open cards opening packs is easy we got systems everything's going to end up in the right place i just don't want to be responsible for counting uh, but we will have battles again on monday we'll have a lot of battles however many battles you all want to fill we'll fill on monday as long as i have the product 
Uh, so we got done with that battle. Up next, we have Ryan getting five Karloff Manor play packs for $19.99. Limit one per person per stream. And an Outlaws Collector Pack. Good luck. Here we go. Yeah. Yep. For sure, Jank. Uh, Shard of Broken Glass from the list. Ill-Timed Explosion Rare. Hedge Maze Rare. Definitely do uh, less freelance writing than I used to, but I still do some. Still Chasing Force of Vigor. That is a fun one. Cranko Rare. Ace of the Uneaten Feast. What was that other uh, uncommon somebody said something about? Aftermath the Analyst is two bucks now. Rakdos, Peyton Turn and Chaos, Mythic, and Thundering Falls. I feel like there's so many comments and uncommons in the set that are over a dollar now. It's crazy. If you messed up and it's an honest mistake, that's fine. Kaya Spirits, Justice, Mythic, Deadly Cover Up Rare. I'm not going to hold anybody's feet to the fire. But it's intended to be one per person per stream. If you goof, that's fine. We're not going to make anybody get in trouble or anything like that Anzrex rampage rare if it was something we had like super limited quantity on like a lot collector packs obviously we would have to enforce it but i can get more carl of manor play boxes so appreciate your honesty with that here's the collector pack of luck see if we can find that force of vigor dust animus reanimate so sadly not force of vigor forger's foundry tarnation vista what in Tarnation chat? Got the Vault Frame Tarnation Vista and the Big Score Mythic. And a Stingerback Terror. The Fun Dragon. Scorpion Dragon. Have a good night, Ken. Appreciate you stopping by on your lunch break. Hope the rest of your shift goes well. Reanimate's definitely a fun one. Uh, Logan up next getting two Outlaws Collector Packs. Like Logan. Here we go. If you're new, welcome to the stream. What's up, y'all? Don't you mean Yeehaw 143 Plenty? Uh, foil Mana Drain. Logan, congrats. Beautiful card. Dot Seas. Wow, what a double mythic. That's insane. Discreet Retreat, Aven Interrupter, and Worldwalker Helm. Big score mythic. Double Terminal Agony. No agony in that pack. Uh, Foil, Riku of Many Paths, Siphon Insight, Heretic Charge, Lila, and Taiwa Keen. Uh, if you're new, welcome. My name is Lance Coffin. I'm your Ripping Ship host this evening. I normally stream Monday and Thursday at 30 Eastern Time. Queen Honey streaming Saturday at 1. If y'all would like to join us then. Uh, no more battles for tonight, but we do still have plenty of packs. If you'd like to buy packs, we ship to the U.S. Shipping is $6 for up to nine packs or $10 for up to a 500 count box. We ship out once a week. Our next shipment is Thursday the 18th. They can combine orders from tonight, Saturday, and Monday all into one order if you'd like. Chris getting two Woe, two Who, two RVR, and two OTJ collectors. What's the other one? RVR. Uh, but that's how much shipping is. You can buy packs at moonshotgamestore.com slash live if you're interested. It is one Eastern on Saturday. That is correct. I talked to her today and we set up the Honestly, I would like to keep it regular, so hopefully we can do one Eastern every Saturday. But we haven't gotten that far yet, so don't count on that. Yet. That's the goal. Okay, we got all the packs now for Chris. Good luck, Chris. 
the rest of these away. Yeah, it's one Eastern day after tomorrow. Let's start with Doctor Who since we have to sleeve the whole pack since it's all Rares and Mythics. Then we'll continue with the rest. Uh, we have Jacob S and Jacob M after this. Then we have Collector Battle 3, Play Battle 2. Then we'll be done with battles for tonight. Planes, 13th Doctor, Surge, Mythic. Nice. Dalek Squadron, Path of Ancestry, Skycloud Expanse, Love That Art, Dreamer Cascade, Jenny, Generated Anomaly, Carpet of Flowers, Me, the Immortal, Fiery Islet, Ian Chesterton Surge, River Tears Surge, Preordained Surge. That's nice. Third Doctor and a Foil First Doctor for Pack 1. Race foil would be sick. Those are so cool. I love seeing them every time we pull one. Second Doctor Who collector. Swamp. Third Doctor. This is how it ends. Overgrown Farmland. Four Knox. Surge of Brilliance. Clara Oswald. Temple of Abandon. 13th Doctor. Extended Foil Mythic. Chaos Warp. Yasmin Khan. Surge. Waterlog Grove. Surge. Aces Baseball Bat. Surge. Tenth Doctor Mythic. This one uh, looks a little off center to me. And Foil Tardis. I guess it's not that off center. Just how the frame looks. There you go. Tenth Doctor, obviously very popular Doctor. Not sure mechanic wise. Haven't actually played with the Doctor, so I don't know exactly what it does. Uh, the sleeves that we use, they're not team bags, they're sleeves for like that whole pack. It goes into a BCW thick card sleeve. Uh, Restless Bivouac Foil. Leyline of the Void. Ariat Borderless Mythic. Nestling or Nettling Nuisance. And Sir Ginger, which was actually the most popular card in the set, surprisingly, based on their polling. Uh, and then team bags. Rough Triplets, Foil Extended, Leyline of Abundance, Art Flame Duelist, Yenna, and Raging Paddle Mouse. The uh, team bags we use, we use BCW team bags, and then for the bigger ones, we use like these bags that we get off Amazon. I don't know their name, but they're like just larger versions. One's a 4x6 bag, and one's a 5x7 bag. Chris, here is your Outlaws. Bad Mirror, New Blood, Villainous Wealth, Angel of Indemnity, Wily Duke, and Calamity. So that is pack one for you. Gonna get these sleeved up. And we have three more packs headed your way. Yeah, it's going to the moon. The question is, are any actually selling at that dollar amount? If so, that's crazy. There is Outlaws Collector Hack 2. We have a Foil, Fell the Mighty, Primal Command, Leland Dowser, Archmage's Newt, and Free Strider Lookout. Can't wait to start drafting this set, chat. It's going to be so fun. No problem, Cryptek. Starting with a Foil, Infernal Tutor Old Border, Overgrown Tomb Borderless, Cinder Vines, and Mind Leech Mass with a guild gate and then one more pack here uh full borg missing rage Cranko anime old border chromatic lantern atomic foil and then the Zorius guild gate with a rhythm of the wild there you go chris we'll get this sleeved up like if you got for three collector boxes land tax anime that hasn't sold yeah, the land tax anime isn't uh, some type of anime that some magic players are looking for. Jacob S. getting two play in a collector of outlaws of mech. As the card quality, I think it's fine. Like, I honestly don't have a big problem with Magic's card quality overall, though. So, I'm probably not the person you want to ask. I'm not, like, super nitpicky. Overwhelming Forces, Big Score Mythic. Or, sorry, 
uh breaking news mythic in nebraska mythic so that was a great pack double mythic but i also literally just open the cards and then we package them up so i'm not like leaving them out to see how bad they curl and stuff like that so three steps ahead full rare outlaws merriment rare hell to pay rare they're printed in japan so if you like the japanese print then you'll like these i personally like the belgian foils the most than the u.s foils than the Japanese print foils, but everybody's different. Foil Free Strider, look out. Mana Drain. Congratulations, Jacob. Dead Before Sunrise, Stingerback Terror, and Omen Path Journey. Big score. Mythic. We get those sleeved up. Up next, we have Jacob M. Getting a five pack of MKM play packs. Limit one per person per stream. Jacob's got all the man free. There is a sizable number of Jacobs in stream tonight. Here we go. How can you find out where each set's printed? So the way I tell is this dotted pattern is a Japanese print pack. You'll see it on like the collector packs too. Those are Japanese print packs. This print pattern is a US print pack, but it does also say on the back of the pack uh, where it's printed this one. Uh, I'm not gonna tear the flap, flap up on this. So like this one says Fabrique in the status Unice. Uh, but if you look on here, it does say made in the USA basically right before that. Um, these ones will say Fabrique on Japan. So made in Japan. It should be in English somewhere too, but yeah, here it is. Made in Japan right here. Uh, thank you so much for the raid. Quarantined Capricorn. Hopefully uh, all is well now and you're doing better. What, uh, what all were you playing tonight? Everybody go check out Quarantine Capricorn on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash Quarantine Capricorn. Sorry, my hands are a bit busy. Can't type right now for a shout out, but y'all got one. We also have another 166 people on YouTube. So just uh, wanted to share the love over there as well. That's why I always do the verbal shout outs. Uh, Steam Core Scholar. Glad to hear you're having a community night. Hopefully it went well. Pick your poison. That's over a dollar now. Uh, glad you found us tonight. It was trying their best to destroy some were successful. Gotcha, gotcha. Full Spear, Midnight's Light, Full Rare, Tesa, Opulent, All Arc Rare. So what we do here is we open Insidious Roots. We open Magic Gathering Packs. People buy packs, we open them up, and then we ship them to them. We're opening up mostly Outlaws of Thunder Junction tonight, the brand new set. Pre-releases tomorrow. All these are technically pre-sales. Uh, you can pick them up tomorrow in store in Noblesville, Indiana. Barb Servitor Rare. We ship out once a week on Thursdays. So our next ship out will be on Thursday the 18th. And you can get your card shipped to you as well. So, Welcome in, Raiders. Thank you so much for coming to hang out with us tonight. That's the whole tab. The main fan too. That's correct. Vicious Interrogation. Um... I don't know why people like opening packs with this. Like it tears, but then it's awful and just so bad and cringy. And like, then you still have to go in and open the pack. It's just like, yeah, so I just open the pack. I don't use the full tabs, but they each their own. Fugitive Codebreaker Foil Rare and War Leader's Call. That's a good one. And the rest of your pack here. So, Jacob. Appreciate you grabbing some packs. We'll get those in your box for you. Up next, we have an Outlaws of Thunder Junction collector battle. Apparently, I misspelled Outlaws of Thunder Junction in the play battle, but that's what that is, too. It's OTJ, not OTH. Uh, play battle there, but y'all knew that. Let's get the people for this battle. We have uh, uh, Kraken Jank, Jacob, Stephanie, Odious Cards, and Ryan. Good luck. Logan's in play battle. Do that. Which is right after this. Got it. 
How do you go about getting packs? Uh, there's a video you can watch that explains everything. Exclamation point new. Um, in chat, and that'll tell you how to do it. Um, Callie Vol, how you doing? We sent you an email today, I think. Uh, might want to double check, but I think you ended up with two boxes of cards or a box and a half of cards. Uh, so hopefully you were able to, or no, I think I sent you a, I might've sent you a message on discord or no, I think I sent you an email. I don't remember. I think we reached out to you, but, uh, in order to ship everything, we'll need another $10 shipping payment for that. Cali ball. Justin T correct. Wanted to make sure you saw that we could just ship out the one box for now. If you want totally up to you. Um, and then whenever you fill up the next box, you can pay for shipping, get that shipped out. But I know most people want all their new cards the first week. So just wanted to let you know. Odie's card's going to be up first. And then we have Crack and Jank. We have Jacob. And we have Ryan. And then we have Stephanie. Good luck, everybody. I can't remember if I had Sarah send you an email. I don't think we had talked on discord let me check and see if i sent you an email i don't think i sent you an email i think probably it came from like support at moonshotgamestore.com or sarah at moonshotgamestore.com but if you didn't get it just let me know we'll make sure we shoot you that email we we're just packing stuff up today and some people had more cards than they thought they did so let me get the back end taken care of real quick here We'll be good to go. Battle time chat's exciting. This is the last collector battle of the evening. Good luck, everybody. Thank you again for the raid Twitch. We're trying to get 740 followers tonight. We need six more followers this evening. If anybody's new, enjoys magic content, wants to come back, hang around, definitely appreciate a follow. Uh, YouTube, we're trying to get to uh, 100 likes right now. We're at 69 likes, but if we get to 100, we get to hit the yeehaw button. Uh, two, so packs are coming from the right. We always pass them out left to right. Again, this is the last collector battle of the evening. Right after this, we'll have our last play battle of the evening. Yeah, Odious, I think I talked to you on Discord. That's correct. Battles are a lot of fun. We'll have more on Monday, not head for sure. I just, I'm not confident in my ability to count until 2 a.m. tonight. So we're calling battles early tonight. But if people want to get packs, we have plenty of packs, a lot of selection. Uh, I see them all scrolling across the screen here. Uh, but we'll have more battles on Monday. Queen Honey doesn't do battles yet. Prime subs are awesome. We always appreciate them. Assimilation, Aegis, Extended Flow, Mythic. Endless Detour. So we're at three and three. Arcane Heist is four. Roxanne for five. And Satoru for two for Odious Cards. First pack here. On to pack two. Yeah, battles are a blast. I always have a great time doing them. I just don't want to count somebody's cards wrong. Decimate for four. Decimate still. We're very decimated for another four. Elemental Eruption for six. Tiny Bones joins up for one. And Roxanne again for another five. So we got an extended and a regular Roxanne. Unfortunately, multiple duplicates there, but sometimes booster packs do that to us. The so three, six, 10, 15, 17, 21, 25, 31, 32, 37 for Odie's cards. We'll see where that puts you. Crack and Jank up next. What are the double masters chase cards? Been a while. Man, I forgot what number I just said. This is why we're not doing battles all night. Let's recount. 5, 6, 12, uh, 16, 20, 22, 27, 31, 34, 37. Was that right? I think that was right. Yeah, that sounds right. Okay, we're there. Jank up next. Uh, no, you're... You're fine. Double, are we talking OG Double Masters or Double Masters 2022? Thank y'all. Act one for Crack and Jank. 
Starting with Lila for three. Commandeer for seven. We ride at dawn for three. Archmage's Newt for two. And Grand Abolisher, big score Mythic for two. Two X two is double masters twenty twenty two. Uh Imperial Seal's one of the big hits. There are some textured cards. Ooh, we have a foil transmutation font in the vault frame for five. Mythic. This is not the raised foil, sadly. Detention Sphere for three. Kiri extended mythic for four. Simulation Aegis extended mythic for three. And another round for three. Maybe for telling battle victory? We'll find out. Uh, 3, 10, 13, 15, 17, 20, 23, 27, 30, 35 for Jake. So not looking very promising, unfortunately. Uh, unless 35 is a really high low, which could be possible. We'll have to wait and see. Jacob up next. Sadly, no appearance of Fibble Thip. Uh, Imperial Seal, I think, is one of the biggest hits in the set. I don't remember what else. If Rexian Altar is a fun one in that set. Um, my brain is just so outlaws. I haven't thought about Double Masters 2022 in a minute. Bring her back there for four. Vanishing Verse for two. Tower Winder for two. Lila for three. And Free Strider Lookout for three. What I do is I go to scryfall.com slash sets. I find the set. I put in the set code 2x2. I search it with control F. Go down, find the set, click on it. And then I do sort by USD. And that's how I tell what the big hits in the set are. Archimedes Charm for three. Abrupt Decay for two. Vengeful Growth for six for Jacob. Marchesa for three. Firebluff Canal for zero. That's uh, the fastest way I've found to look at stuff. The pricing isn't always exactly accurate. I think it's like a day old TCG market or something. But it gives you an idea. Four, six, eight. 11, 14, 17, 19, 25, 28. So we're in a new low here. 3, 9, 11, 14, 17, 20, 22, 24, 28 for Jacob. So Jacob feeling like in a pretty good spot here. Unfortunately, Jake, that does put you in the middle. I do appreciate you battling. Ryan is going to be up next. Uh, no textures, no raised foils yet. We do you have a borderless foil mythic? Oh, go though. It's pretty sick for four. Ooh, and a mind break trap for another four. This is a busted pack. Cactus preserve for zero. Double tip lost on the range for three. And tarnation vista chat. What in tarnation was that booster pack? Do we have a sorting machine? We do. Oh, we actually have a couple different ones. Void Slime for three. Mind Slaver, Mythic for six. Nice. Bounding Board for three. Even Interrupter for three. And Tywakeen for two. Double Humiliate. We have four, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 20, 23, 26, 28. We're tied at 28. 28 ends up being the low spot. We'll talk about tiebreakers. 2, 5, 8. Uh, 8 and 6 is 14, 17, 20. We are at 28. So Jacob and Ryan both at 28. Stephanie, last but not least. Look, Stephanie, you need 27 or 38. Uh, we have a Roko, we have a Cardbot, and we have a Fizzbatch 9000. And I don't know that I'm allowed to talk about them beyond that. Caustic Bronco for two. Archmage's Charm for three. Crackling Spellslinger for five. Eldepay for one. And Stingerback Terror for four. That Oko is really cool. For Magic Sorter, very cool. Haven't tried that one. Sealed Courtyard, Borderless Foil for zero. Pry for three. Theory Extended, Foil Mythic for four. Sword of Wealth and Power, first one of the night in the Vault Frame Mythic for three. Congrats. Assimilation Aegis Mythic for three as well. Let's see where this ends up. 
So we have 2, 5, 10, 11, 15, 18, 22, 25, 28. You've got to be kidding. So we have a three-way tie for the low. 3, 6, 10, 13, 17, 18, uh, 23, 26, 28. So we have 28, verified 28. So the way the tiebreaker works is we look for the lowest man of out, or sorry, the lowest collector number from the main set, not the breaking news set, the main set. So I say OTJ in the bottom corner. We're looking for the rare mythic closest to number one. So that will be one of these two cards. Extended art borderless. Those are going to be at the back end of the numbers. Breaking news aren't main set. Commander aren't main set. These are all fancy treatments, so they're going to be at the back of the numbers. So these two are going to be your slot. So your lowest one, 192 or 147, is going to be 147, Stephanie. So you're hoping nobody else has a main set rare mythic lower than 147. It does not count the big score either. So if you got double big score cards, you're pretty much knocked out because your lowest card is going to be one from the back. So like an extended art or something. So like Tarnation Vista doesn't count, but we have to double check our score first. We have three, seven, 11, 13, 16, 19, 25, 28. So we do have 28. Iowa Keen is gonna be your lowest card from the main set. That is 234, which unfortunately is not lower than 147, Ryan. So that knocks you out. Apologies, Jacob. As a free strider lookout, that's not going to be low enough. Hopefully your other one's lower if you want to win that. 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 and 4 is 14. Spire Bluff Canal's not lower either. 17, 23, 25, 28. So we're tied, but your lowest card is free strider lookout. That is card number 163. Stephanie has 147. So Stephanie wins the tiebreaker. Three-way tie. Crazy. So Odious Cards gets the high spot. Stephanie gets the low spot. Uh, we have had... <laughs> we have... Uh, we've had three-way ties before. But not very many. Uh, Odious Cards. Odds left, evens right for your pack. Three left pack for Odious Cards. Right pack for Stephanie. Stephanie, this is your pack. Good luck. Imagine being the only middle number out of five. Just less suspense for you, that's all. Dog Sphinx, Siphon Insight, Smirking Spelljacker, Smuggler Surprise, and Great Train Heist for your bonus pack there. Stephanie will get those added to your pile. Apparently, writing three-way tie causes problems with filters on Twitch. There are a lot of cards in the five sets in this set. It's interesting, Nuthead. Yeah, 8,000 cards. You will probably be running that out most of the time. Tawakeen, Reanimate, Angelic Cell Sword, Satoru, Wanted Poster, very cool, and Marchesa, Dealer of Death. I don't even know how much Magic Sworders are. I, I think... Uh, What's the channel name? Uh, Kitchen Table TCG. I think they have one of those. It's not too bad. I know the other ones can be pretty expensive. But I imagine the expense comes with reliability or speed or something. Else. Okay, here we go. Thank you so much for the uh, shipping payments, y'all. Appreciate you. Uh, up next, we have our play battle. This is our last battle of the evening. This one has Sean, Jacob, Odious Cards, Boyd, and Logan. Good luck, y'all. We'll have more battles Monday for sure. We'll do a lot of battles if y'all want to do a lot of battles. I like battles. Uh, this is just my seventh day streaming out of eight days, so need uh need to make sure I can count well uh, before we do more battles. So just taking the brain a little bit too long to process. 
Now it's like twenty five hundred up front and then thirty dollars a month for support based on what I just read. Throw these cards, Boyd, Logan, Jacob, and Sean. Good luck, y'all. We do have play and collector packs of Outlaws in stock. We have a bunch of other sets in stock, too. So if you'd like to get some stuff, we'd be happy to open packs for you tonight. Thank you, Cali Paul. Appreciate you. Uh, so you only have to pay for shipping once per shipping week. Shipping week start on Thursday and end on Monday. Um, as long as you stay under your pack limit. So let's say you paid six dollars for the nine pack shipping option and you bought three packs the first time right as long as you get six or less packs you could just pick rip and hold and we'll combine your orders and automatically ship them out if you had picked the ten dollar option the first time you could fit up to a 500 count box if you end up going over your nine packs you can pay six dollars again and we just treat it like a ten dollar box or you can pay ten dollars for your second one and then uh, when we reconcile our shipping payments, normally once or twice a month, uh, we'll see that you didn't use the $6 option and you use that $10 option that week. And then we'll issue you a $6 gift card later on. But that's the option for that. I don't know, Rats. I don't have one. So you'd have to talk to Nuthead. Odds left, evens right. Well, from the right, each person gets six packs in this battle. These play packs are a lot of fun, chat. These boxes have a lot of rares and mythics in them. Um, personally, I don't collect the commander set, and if I did, I would just buy the commander decks because you get all the cards that way. At least I think you do. Um, but I kind of like not having commander rares and mythics in the play boosters. Uh, new orders always go to the bottom of the queue. I cannot move people up because everybody's patiently waiting for their turn. If you want, I can push your early order to your later order. I can push stuff back. I just can't pull it forward. Do I play commander? I do play some commander. I don't play a ton of commander. I don't have a lot of time to play commander. Uh, I have two young kids and a wife and a dream and all sorts of stuff. Breaches for three. You know, work outside of the stream, just a lot going on. So I don't get a lot of time to play Commander. I play a lot of Limited on Arena. And I do play Commander from time to time. I have a Prosh deck. I have a Lateral deck I need to put back together. Um, and I have some Precons, too. Primal Command for five. Enrique with many pass for three. Odious cards, I don't know how you always end up going first, but you're going first again. Hopefully it ends up working well for you, Nothead. You'll have to let us know how it goes. Flame Jumper for three. Card Sorters can be great if, obviously, you... Uh, can justify the cost for your time. Ionize for three. Omen Path Journey, Big Score, Mythic for four. And Caustic Bronco for two. So getting a ton of rares here. Two more packs. I'd love to be able to bring stuff up, but unfortunately, I just don't feel it's fair to everybody else. Grindstone, Mythic for one. Bristlebud Farmer, Mythic for four. Flickshot, Show Off for two. Because basically other people make orders based on what they see on the schedule, and if we add extra packs to it, and other people add extra packs to it, it can add a lot of wait time, basically. Well, we will be streaming... Uh, Get Raw, Gravenous Ride, Mythic for five, and Laughing Jasper Flint for another three. We'll be streaming Saturday at 1 o'clock Eastern Time with uh, Queen Honey, and I'll be streaming again Monday night, 8.30 Eastern Time. And if you want to get in early on the streams, just order before the stream starts and you end up toward the beginning normally. Uh, obviously, during release or pre-sales times with new sets, things get a little crazy. But during normal streams, if you order before the stream, you're normally pretty early on. So uh, we have breaches for three. So 3, 8, 11, 14, 17, 21, 23, 24, 28, 30, 35, 38. Pretty good. 8, 10, uh, 14, 15, 17, 21, 24, 27, 30, 38. 38 for odious cards. That seems pretty high.
Void up next. So, at least in the U.S. Uh, so, we normally stream to like 1 or 2 a.m. So, we have plenty of time. Like, I'm not in a rush to get out of here. I just can't count battles well tonight. Uh, Spire Bluff Canal for zero and step between worlds for five. It is 10.36 p.m. So, we have plenty of time tonight. We could basically open everything we've opened all over again. Like, a time and a half. We have plenty of time for packs for tonight. Smuggler's surprise for one. So if anybody wants to get packs, you're not keeping me late. Don't worry. Boyd, here's your next pack. So at least in the U.S., it is like key to the vault for two. I looked into this a lot because before I started working with Moonshot, I uh, was doing this just myself. I was I ran it as coffin cards. If there are a few people maybe in chat that remember that back. Back in the day. Uh, Outcaster Trailblazer for three. One last job for another three. Uh, but I was trying to figure out the same thing. A lot of hobby MTG channels like TCG player stores. How do I get a distributor? You pretty much have to have a physical store. Commandeer for seven. Calamity for another six. That was a massive pack. Mana value wise. 13 in that pack. And so I ended up partnering up with Moonshot and it turned out to be the best thing easy or the best thing ever. Worked out very well. Uh, even Interrupter for three, and that is it. Well, let's math chat while well, I still can. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 21, 27, 30 for Boyd. So Boyd getting 30. What's what's the talk about dollars and years? I'm I missed something somewhere. I'm confused what the conversation's about. Logan getting six packs. Good luck. Uh no, I, I work with Ooh, foil borderless poster mythic. Oko, the ringleader for four. That's hot. Attention sphere for three. Wow. Stoneforge Mystic special guest mythic. Let's go for two. Roxanne for five. Can we get the mythic five rare pack? No, only four. Uh, I'm at Moonshot right now. We're streaming at Moonshot. I am local to Moonshot. That was an insane pack. Best control, big score, mythic for two, and stinger back terror for four. The so Logan getting a great start here. Yeah, Black T, I can move. Uh, I can move your order down if you want, so we open it all together. Can definitely do that for you. Uh, Lotus ring, big score, mythic for three. First ring of the night, very nice, and a cool for another four. Two more, three more packs. Wow, still three more packs. That's crazy. Oh, I would charge way more than $30 a month, personally. Uh, Satoru, one imposter, rare for two. Honestly, I don't know how much luck you're going to have running it to your LGS. Because, like, if your LGS wanted one, they would just buy one. license hers for two and helps for posse boss for four you'd also be have to keep it in working condition and all that stuff like i would probably charge them by the thousand cards or something 30 is the monthly support fee that makes more sense bow token outcaster trailblazer for three here we go let's math logan four seven nine 14, 16, 20, 23, 27, 29, 31, 35, 38. So we're tied at 38 wild. 3, 7, 9, 11, 15, 18, 22, 24, 29, 31, 34, 38. So we're tied at 38 for the high spot. Odious cards and Logan. We'll uh, have to. We know Logan has 38 for sure. Let's find your lowest card just so we don't have to do that later. So far, it's the terror. 
Elspur Posse Boss. Elspur Posse Boss is your lowest card. Wild how many different sets are in these packs, chat. Uh, so card 128 is your lowest card, Logan. If we end up time for the high spot. And uh hate to break it to you, but right now, if Odie's cards really has 38, the card sitting on top over there is Caustic Bronco, which is card number like 80 something. So Odie's cards is winning the tiebreaker right now if Odie's cards really has 38. Uh, but yes, I so we'll pull your box when we get to it, but I will set it aside and we'll open it all together, Black D. We'll definitely do that for you. All right, chat, one second. Hi, Ro. How you doing? We're battling. These are Jacob's packs here. Good luck, Jacob. Uh, final showdown. Mythic for one. One start. You got a foil textured Oko. Congratulations. That's sick. A beautiful card. Colossal Rattle Worm for four. So now you have a textured and a raised Obeka for another four. Pretty sick. I think Oko is one of the better ones too. Uh, we will not be doing any more battles tonight, unfortunately. Hostile Investigator Mythic for four. Honorary Tumblewag for three. We'll be doing more battles Monday for 100% sure. Um, basically this is my seventh day of streaming out of eight days and yesterday and today all day I packed cards for like hours. So my brain's a little shot right now. Dust Bowl for zero, Fortune for three, and I don't want to mess up any battles. So I would rather not do battles than do battles and potentially mess them up. So we'll have more battles on Monday. Uh, we'll have packs tonight. If you want to get packs, feel free. Happy to open them for you. Um, we're good to like 2 a.m. tonight. Collector's Cage, Big Score Mythic for two, and Bruce Tarl for four. Um, Queen Honey will be streaming on Saturday. She'll be good to open packs for y'all. Uh, but battles will be next time on Monday. Giza, the Hellraiser Mythic for five, and Marchesa for another three for your last pack. Yeah, only human. Very real way to put it. I'm not an AI yet. Yet. Uh, one, five, nine, 13, 16. There's no cost on the Dust Bowl. 19, 21, 25, 30, 33, which unfortunately puts you right in the middle. 8, 12, 14, 17, 20, 24, 28, 32, 33. So 33, Jacob, unfortunately, you're in the middle there. But thank you so much for battling. If you want to grab some more packs, we're happy to open packs for you. I can open packs all night long. That doesn't take mental bandwidth of counting. I can very easily get the right pack and leave cards for you. That's not a mental capacity issue. Pariah for three and Pitiless Carnage for four for Sean. Electro Dominance for two and Tiny Bones for one. Black T, how'd you find us? Always curious how people find us on Twitch. Was it just like a recommended thing or did you come over from the raid or? I, I don't really understand how people find us on Twitch though. So. Building Bell be nice. Magda for two. Twitch has always been a bit confusing on how it works to me. Wow, Terror of the Peaks Mythic for five. Very nice Mythic, congrats. Uh, two more packs, chat. Mitch, that's awesome, thank you. Thieshwell Avarice, MTG North guys are great. We talk from time to time. It's always cool to see what fun stuff they open. 
we mostly do live streams here. We don't do a lot of recorded videos and we do a ton of YouTube shorts. Ariette for four. We mainly do like box opening videos when a new set comes out and then in between the doing the same videos over and over again just gets a little tiring to me personally, but maybe we'll do some video recorded videos in the future, but we're not there right now. Uh, three, seven, nine, 10, 12, 17, 18, 22. Wow, very low. Four, five, 10, 12, 13, 15, 19, 22. So Sean gets the low spot here with 22. Sorry, boy, that puts you in the middle. Um, we need to recount Odious cards. If Odious cards has 38, which I'm pretty sure he does, uh, then Odious cards will win the tiebreaker because you have a Caustic Bronco, which is card 82. And uh, Logan's lowest card is um, one twenty-eight. The Hellspur Posse boss. The so two, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, twenty, twenty-three, twenty-six, thirty-one, thirty-three, thirty-seven, thirty-eight. The so odious cards. Uh, you also had a claim jumper, which was card number eight, which is even super lower. So, uh, Odie's cards win in the tiebreaker there. Sorry, Logan was very close, though. Uh, Sean getting the low spot. Odie's cards getting the high spot. Odds left, evens right. Seven, three left packs for Odie's cards. Three right for Sean. We always open the low spot first. Uh, and he joins up. So chat, this was the last battle. Appreciate everybody getting battles in. We'll have more battles on Monday. A bow token. Love it. Bonnie Paul in the same pack. It was meant to be. It was meant to be, chat. Endless Detour. Tarnation Vista Mythic. What in Tarnation chat? The Colossal Rattle Worm. There you go, Sean. We'll get those sleeved up for you. Then we have three packs for Odious Cards. And we'll be opening packs the rest of the night. If like to get some pack orders in, we have plenty of time to open them up for you. Um, schedule looks a little long, but we have a couple people that just paid for shipping in there, so those will go away. Then we have uh, three orders off screen right now. Rep Decay and Rush of Dread for pack one for Odie's cards. Watch too much magic plus love seeing packs up. Saw you one night opening LCI was hooked. Well, I appreciate you finding us, Crypto. Contagion Engine, nice mythic, and Malcolm the Eyes. I assume it was just like a recommended stream or something, Crypto. Like I showed up on the sidebar on Twitch or something like that. Ellen the Kid mythic. We don't actually get a ton of raids here, which may or may not be surprising. I don't know. There are not many pack openers on on YouTube or YouTube on Twitch. The chat brain, not the best at talking. Thank you all so much for battling. Going to get these put away. Up next, we have Ken getting Lord of the Rings Special Edition and two Outlaws pack. Collectors packs, I should say. So looking for our first textured card or our first uh, raised foil card of the night. They've been hard to find tonight. Worth it to buy a collector box of Outlaw? If you like new set, shiny treatments, fun cards, and the theme, and you like buying collector boxes, I'd say it probably is, but obviously that's a very personal decision. You're talking like monetarily value wise. That's always just depends on what you pull. I'm glad you did too. Uh, so I have to make a bunch of name cards chat. I'm going to take care of that real quick and then we'll be opening up packs for a while. You can watch for a little bit. Uh, Yago, if you want. We ship to the U.S. So as long as you're in the U.S. shipping six bucks for 
up to nine packs for 10 bucks for up to a 500 count box. You can order packs at moonshotgamestore.com slash live. Ship out once a week on Thursdays. So anything ordered tonight will go out on Thursday the 18th. Uh, we'll also be streaming Saturday at 1 o'clock with Queen Honey and Monday 8.30 with me, Lance Cawthorn. Um, so you can uh, add more to your shipment on either of those days and then we'll ship out on Thursday next week. Do the magic, sell the Wild West theme, decide to try this game out. Hope you pull something nice tonight. I hope you pull something nice too. But the good news if you're new to magic is all the cards are cool because you get to start building decks figuring out what you want to do so already served modern horizons 3 yeah modern horizons 3 is gonna be pretty powerful i think so a lot of people looking forward to that set some people dreading it but uh either way we're from singapore it is friday for you nice eugene good luck you should post in our discord what you pull i'd love to see it yeah i uh i love that y'all are able to watch i wish we i wish we could ship internationally uh, but cost, import fees, customs problems, packages getting lost, all unfortunately make it a uh, pretty not good idea from business perspective. So we are getting all the name cards ready so that we can start opening up packs again. Appreciate your patience. If you have any questions, now is a great time to ask. I will do my best to keep up with that. But we're getting there. Appreciate everybody hanging out. Do we ever get to 100 likes tonight? I know we're probably pretty close. 75 likes, only need 25 more. Nice. I did not get the uh, Children's Secret Layer, but I know a lot of people did. But uh, I've not heard anything about them shipping yet. Okay, so the other thing we have to do is add people to the box topper list. I saw some packs on there that uh, need to get put on our box topper randomizer. So let me check the order first. And then we'll get the box topper stuff. So we have N Tyler, Mitchell, Black Key. We're not going to open it, but we're going to pull your box then. Matthew, Keith, Loose Cannon, Jacob. Uh, Chris paid for shipping. But I think that was for your order that was just a little bit higher up tonight. So we don't need that. Uh, then we have Myth, Josh, Casey, Durrell, Edward. I think Seeker paid for shipping for stuff this week. Jonathan, Justin definitely paid for stuff for this week. Shannon, Black Tea. That's when we're going to open all your stuff. Black Tea. And then two for Angelino. Thank you so much for subscribing or following or whoever, whatever did. No, textured cards are really rare. They're in 1.3% of packs. So it's going to take multiple boxes to hit a textured card. We've not hit one yet tonight. They're definitely not one per box. So we have Lord of the Rings set for Mitchell. What we're doing here, chat, is for boxes that have box toppers that are worth more than a couple bucks. Uh, we write down who buys every pack in the box, and we use random.org to pick who gets the box topper based on your pack numbers. Uh, we have to wait till the box fills up, though. So if your stuff already shipped, we'll just put your name on it, and then the next time you get stuff shipped out, We'll get it with the rest of your cards, but uh, we do the best we can there so that people have a chance at the box toppers. Jacob getting two Lord of the Rings set. Outlaws, Twix2, DMR, Val, OTJ, Strix, DTK, MB1, Mom, 1, OTJ, OTJ. Got it. So no boxes are full. Uh, Ken, you are up. Yeah, so we try to we try to do what we would want done for our case, right? Like obviously in store you can't keep up with that. Too many people come in and out, and I mean some people you never see again. Um, got two textured of four packs. 
Yeah, I mean, like, if you get them from different boxes and stuff, that's definitely possible. One guy back to back and back to backpacks got a vault raised uh, foil and a textured, so it's it's possible. Uh, exclamation point shop, Marcha. The so Lord of the Rings Special Edition and two Outlaws for Ken. Good luck. See what we can pull you tonight. I have not seen two textured in the same box based on what I've opened. We've opened a lot of packs. Starting out with Vanishing Verse, Dust Bowl, Lock and Load, Loot, the key to everything, Extended Mythic, very nice from the big score, and Campbell. Everybody wants the loot, it seems like. Rainfire says, good luck, Big Ken. Thank you, Rainfire. We have a Foil Archive Trap. That's pretty fun. Void Rend, Elemental Eruption, Smuggler Surprise, and Gitrog, Ravenous Ride Mythic. Now for your Lord of the Rings Special Edition Collector Pack. Silver Foil Surge. Lost Style Calling, Silver Foil Subjugate, The Hobbits, The Ladfram Brigade Scene, Moria Marauder Surge, Mary Doc, Brandy Buck, Surge Uncommon, and a Foil Poster Glamdring. Very cool looking card there. Congratulations again. Get those sleeved up for you. Up next, we have Tyler getting four Outlaws Collector Pack. Here we go, Tyler. Uh, you can see it in person. It's really hard to see on camera. It's a very like double feature type foiling, a mattish foiling. Will Botanical Sanctum, Grindstone Mythic, Angelic Cell Sword, Railway Brawler Extended Mythic, and Ornery Tumblewag. Also, if you look in the bottom left down here between the set code and the language code, if it's a star, it's a foil. If it's a dot, it's a non-foil. And then the specific um, parts of the pack, the silver foils always come in the same slots in every uh, Lord of the Rings Special Edition Collector Pack. So it makes it easier. Foil Wanted Poster, Giza, the Hellraiser Mythic, Void Slime, Cactus Preserves, Satori Wanted Poster, and Bonnie Paul. A few more packs for Tyler. Which we're trying to get 740 followers tonight. Ooh, we got one. I don't know if I've seen this one. Mana Drain, Tyler, congrats. This is one of the three we haven't pulled yet. This is probably the biggest one you can get. How sick is that? Congratulations. Also got a Fell the Mighty. Yeah, that's the first Mana Drain we've pulled. Congratulations. Now all we have to pull is Indomitable Creativity and Contagion Engine. There it is again. See if I can show it off. So hard. Hitting the light at the right angle without getting the glare, but obviously want to keep it in that top loader. Congrats, Tyler. See what else you get. Starting with a Fell the Mighty. All right, Vengeful Growth, Fibble Thip, and a Vault Born Tyrant. Big score, Mythic. Let's go. Exactly. Exactly. One more pack. See what else you got. Boil. Ariette. Reanimate. Powerwinder. Pitiless Carnage. And Insatiable Avarice. But congrats on the Mana Drain. Huge pull. Pretty much, I think, the top pull in the set. Um... Maybe one of the vault raised foils will end up higher. I'm not sure. But uh, crazy card. Played all over the place in Commander. Everybody's going to want to bling their deck out. That's a good one to hit. Congrats, Tyler. Next, we have Mitchell. Mitchell's getting all sorts of packs.
Let's see. Lord of the Rings set, Mom Collector, RVR 4 pack. Neo set, Who Collector, LCS. Thank you so much for subscribing. Appreciate you. Okay, so we have LCI set, Neo set, four Ravnica Remastered, Lord of the Rings set, Mom Collector, and Who Collector. Good luck, Mitchell. Here's your name card. Let's go. I don't know where we're going, but we're going somewhere, chat. Owen Grady, Raptor Trainer, getting a Jurassic World card. Corpses the Lost and a Foil Poison Dart Frog. Queen Honey would be in love right now. Got our showcases up front. The Tora Umizawa, rare. Four Raven Curry Master Draft. Goblin Token, that's pretty cool. Ghostway, rare. Appreciate everybody hanging out tonight on pre-release Eve. Thinks is Revelation Old Border Rare. Hope everybody gets all the crazy pulls in their pre-release skits if you're planning to play. Hopefully you get a uh, good constructed deck's worth there. So you can build a competent deck. Full Smear Wolf Blood Rare. I still remember the time I went to the DME pre-release. I opened two Thran portals and then my promo stamp card was also a Thran portal. It was the worst. I had three Thran portals. Yeva rare. I would probably play like one at most. Lord of the Rings setback. Holy font. Flame of Anor rare. How are you doing tonight, Jake and Joel? Sorry, I uh, never actually said welcome. I read your message, but I didn't say hi. Hope uh, your evening is going well. Fire Main Commando, Glissa, and the Icker. Excise the Imperfect. Finn, Etch Draft, Oil Infernal Sovereign Mythic, and a Baral, Chief of Compliance. We'll sleeve these up. Then we have your Doctor Who collector pack where it is up to 14 rares and methods. So we just sleeve the whole pack. Then up next, we're pulling Black Tea's collector box. Surge Forest, Seventh Doctor, Blink, Irrigated Farmland, Rogue's Passage, Waterlaw Grove, Waymaker's Trap, Thespian Stage, Rose Tyler Foil, Stalem Simulacrum. Sad robot chat, sad robot. Confession Dial Surge, Grasp of Fate Surge, Rory Williams Surge, Yasmin Khan, and a Foil Missy. Also got a Surge Foil Dalek token. We've got all those sleeved up for you. Black Tea, we're going to hold your box and we'll open it when we get down to your other packs. Per your request. Here's your box. Going to set this aside. Open it when we get to your other stuff. Uh, Matthew, getting two Outlaws and two 2x2 collector packs. Finishing off that box. Good luck to you. Hope there's some sick stuff waiting in here for you. We have hit hilariously in the same box multiple times. The textured foil and a raised foil. So still in the same box here for I don't know why I opened that pack that way I never open these packs this way but we're doing it that we're doing it uh you can buy them at WPN stores from what I understand Isaac will dust animus English to making mythic card grave robber harvester misery extended big score mythic and Wiley Duke we will be selling packs at our store imagine all other WPN stores will as well. Uh, 
And I think you have to be a WPN store to do a pre-release. So you should be able to buy packs in store tomorrow. Well, Riku with many paths, Abrupt Decay, Smirking Spelljacker, Archangel, eh, Archangel of Ties Mythic, Ooh, and Oko, the Ringleader Mythic. Great pack. Uh, we'll sleeve these up because I don't think we're going to be able to fit all your Double Masters cards in the same sleeves. Here we are, Double Masters 2022, finishing off the box. Good luck. Let's see what we get here. Starting now with Avon Initiate. Blood Flow Connoisseur. What a Druid. Nice. Boiling Oracle for our first Borderless. Wall of Omens. Monastery Swift Spear Foil. Ooh, Blood Artist. I love that art. First rare mythic. We have Kedarek Leviathan. We have a Borderless. Alenda, the Dusk Rose Mythic with the Crazy Richard King Ferguson art. And we have an etched rare Yeheni Undying Partisan. And then a Borderless Mythic. Ren and Six Foil. That is pretty. Congrats. It's not the textured one, but it is a foil. That is pretty hot. Not going to lie. And our last pack here. Militia Bugler starting us out. Dot Scour for your first borderless. Uh, Eternal Witness. Foiling Oracle Foil. Eternal Witness Foil. First Rare. Bloodforged Battle Axe. Very off center, by the way. Then you get a borderless Bloodforged Battle Axe. Then you get an etched Mythic. As foretold. Love the uh, blue etched. And then a foil. Phyrexian Altar. So double altar box, but that is not something I would complain about. Also got that beautiful borderless foil red and six. Bunch of other cool stuff in there. Hope you enjoyed it. Getting those sleeved up for you. Congrats again on the altar and the Ren and six. Two big hits out of the set. He's up next. Get two Outlaws collector packs. Last two of the box, the last chance of hitting that textured raised in the same box. Starting out with Force of Vigor, nice mythic. Surgical Extraction, Yuma, Borderless Mythic, Surfic Steed, and Outcaster Trailblazer. Act two for Keith. Bamari Vault Extended Big Score Mythic Foil, Unlicensed Hearse, Eris Extended Mythic Foil, Commander, Botanical Sanctum Borderless, and Laughing Jasper Flint. There you go, Keith. Appreciate you grabbing some packs. Let me get the schedule cleaned up real quick. I all of our shipping payments so y'all can see what our actual schedule looks like. If you want to get some packs, the line's not super long. We do have uh, Black T, who's going to be getting almost three collector boxes. Uh, OTJ, one collector box and nine mom collector packs. So that one will probably take a little bit, but everything else should be relatively quick. If you're looking to get some packs, definitely not a bad time to get on the list. You can definitely see the bottom there. And uh, you're not keeping me up late because I'm scheduled to be here up until 2 a.m. So we'll have about three hours left that we can open stuff up for. I'm not the owner of the brick and mortar store. I do work very closely with the owner, though. Uh, the textured foils and the vault raised foils, Tiago, are probably going to be the uh, top hits in the set. So four Ravnica Master draft packs and a one set pack for Loose Cannon. Good luck. Much as I would love to be able to say a store owner would be able to do this and run a store. I don't think anybody has enough time for that to run a store and do all this at the same time. Unless it's a pretty small store. Copperline Gorge starting out with a fun rare. And Osari, Sun's Glory Mythic. The so double rare pack there is pretty nice. Monterab and the Curry Mastered. And four of these draft packs for $19.99. Limit one per person per stream. Starting out with the Watery Grave. A bonus shock in Lazav. Old Border. So double rare pack there. Pretty nice start. Not going to lie. Not going to lie. 
Uh, Krenko, mob boss. Lucky goblin. Uh, like what we sell at? It's just on our website. I'm not sure how it works. Response resurgence rare. We buy 50% of TCG low for cash, 65% of TCG low for credit, from what I understand. There will be OTGJ battles on Monday. Gladstone Curio, Old Border Mythic. Nice way to end it. Um, Queen Honey's our new streamer. She's streaming Saturday at 1 o'clock Eastern time. She is not to a point where uh, we're ready to start battles. Um, she's just got to get the feel of the stream down. She's been doing great. Um, it's just one of those things where you need some repetition to be able to open a lot of packs to be able to build up the speed a little bit. Um, so there will not be battles on Saturday, but there will be more battles on Monday for sure. I will be running multiple battles on Monday. Uh, Jacob, this is Jacob M. I'm going to write this down since there are a lot of Jacobs here tonight. Avoid any confusion. Uh, four Outlaws Collectors, four Commander Master set, five MKM Play, and two Lord of the Rings set. They get you on that Lord of the Rings box topper, so we're good there. We do still have Outlaws Collectors and Play Packs in stock. So 110, how much is taking the joy of opening packs? I love opening packs. It's so much fun. Love casing the big stuff for y'all. Love seeing what cool cards you get. I think I just think it's a blast. I don't. There's definitely some times when I get like tired, but I wouldn't say I get tired of it. I'm just like in general tired because I've been working for a long day or something like. always cool to see chat get excited when we get a big poll all that type of stuff okay so we have five Carl of manor play packs limit one per person per stream uh two lord of the rings set four commander masters set and four outlaws collector packs for jacob Jacob, wish you the best of luck. Zach, how are you doing tonight? Good to see you. Hope life's been treating you well. I might have already said hi, but I don't remember, so I'll say hi again just in case I didn't. As I mentioned, this is uh, our seventh stream out of eight days. Props Eidetic Memory, Rockus Theater Rare, so brain power is a little less than usual. Making sure we didn't miss a good comment or uncommon in that one. Verified rookie. Lamplight Phoenix. Ooh, Wonder City Sewers Borderless Rare. That's nice. Aftermath Analyst is close to a couple bucks now. Slime Against Humanity. So many good commons and uncommons in the set that are worth over a buck that. Uh, we did a box opening of Alliances. That's probably the biggest box we've done. Niv-Mizzet rare. Um, but we haven't done... We've opened some Homelands and Fallen Empires, but not a box. Um, we opened a few packs of 7th edition, but not a box. But that's not really vintage. Uh, Axbane Ferrix rare. We opened a box of Mirrodin Besiege. That was fun. No more lies. I think that might still be over a dollar. We opened a lot of fun stuff. Um, always looking to do more stuff. We just have to wait till we find a box that's priced at the right price point. To make it worth it for everybody. Lobelia Sackful Baggins, because so many of those old boxes are just based on rarity. It just happens kind of when the opportunity presents itself. If there's something affordable that people are looking to break, they're back again rare. Ooh, and a Priest Titanium from list. This is going to be in Modern soon, chat. Um, I'm always open to trying to get stuff, but like somebody was, I'm pretty sure jokingly asking about a Legends box, like that would cost more than many cars and pack prices would be hundreds and hundreds of dollars. So 
obviously we don't have plans to do that anytime soon uh but if the opportunity presented itself mystic confluence size claw nekusar for a three rare commander master set pack with reality shift borderless pack two of four here of commander masters for you jacob evacuation Audric for just two rares in that one counter spell borderless tragic slip was in there that's a special guess now priest is a great card i love it orin frostfang jet medallion that's pretty cool omnath mythic uh a borderless strain dynamo i love that too business casual thanks for following appreciate you here's your last uh that pack of commander masters nahiri full rare wrath of god rare eureka rare the ur dragon borderless mythic very nice portrait style that was a fun pack and kodama's reach get those sleeved up then we'll open your outlaws collectors for you i would love to open that much but i just like i don't even know how many packs is the legends box how many packs was that back then i know they changed the boxes per pack quite a bit back then i don't know why i'm putting all sway we still have your uh four collector packs my bad jacob sorry here we go we're collector packs. We're going to do it. Really, it's going to be really fun. Four collector packs. Here we go. 36 packs in Legends. Nice. Whoa, Vanishing Verse. Fractured Identity Mythic. Leyline Dowser. Bristlebud Farmer Extended Mythic. And Greed's Gambit Mythic. A lot of Mythics in that first pack. I know, like, Homelands and Fallen Empires was 60. Or er, uh, alliances was forty-five. Simulacrum synthesizer, extended mythic, oil, primal command, Felix five boots, extended commander mythic, Malcolm, wanted poster rare and breaches. Yeah, you're definitely not going to get your value back ninety-five percent of the time unless you hit like the top hit and it grades well. Whoa, Campbell, outlaws merriment. We ride at dawn, Vadmir, and Key to the Vault. Uh, but a lot of people, it's just the nostalgia of opening such an old pack and remembering back when it went through. Remember how rare the run was for that? Also felt the printing quality was subpar. Uh, what, Legends? Magda, Foil Extended, Archive Trap, Discreet Retreat, Concealed Courtyard, Borderless, and any Flash, the Veteran Mythic. I remember uh, from DMU, we pulled the Lost Legends Raging Bowl in ahead. What I thought was just a registration print error. Turns out all the Raging Bowls were like that. So, yeah, the print quality was uh, was not crazy good back then. At least during that set. There you go, Jacob. Going to get all this sleeved up for you. Or, well, we already got them sleeved up. I'm going to get them put away for you. Thank you so much for grabbing some packs. Myth, it's time for your critical roll break. Although I guess you can't really pause Twitch. Do they do it mainly on YouTube or Twitch now? Is it live or just recorded? Probably recorded. Either way. Ugh, excuse me, Myth getting two collector packs. Good luck, Myth. Myth not looking for Terror of the Beaks. Would much prefer to get a Gearid. Starting out with a foil. Indomitable creativity, getting a red mythic. Anguish from making double mythic, dead before sunrise, key to the vault, and colossal rattle worm for pack one. Two. It is a pretty cool experience. Not gonna lie. That alliance's box was a blast. Have a foil, smuggler surprise, pest infestation, dream thief's bandana, laughing Jasper Flint, and Serific Steed. Sadly, myth, we did not get the Jirid or however you're supposed to say that. But I uh, appreciate you grabbing a couple packs. Josh up next, getting two play and four collectors. Womp womp.
So two play, four collectors here for Josh. Good luck, Josh. Toast, how you doing? Good to see you. Lila rare. Any deals on Outlaws packs? Yes, the deal is you buy a pack, we open it. That works here. Uh, we have hit, not tonight, but overall, Pest Infestation Rare and Rakdos joins up. We've hit seven raised foils so far. Uh, yeah, we can open a couple collectors to sleep this up. Sorry, chat. Any flash, foil wanted poster, very nice. Mythic, surgical extraction, elemental eruption. Flick shot show off, a lot of people excited about that. And bristlebud farmer. Or pack one. Walmart Chase Extended, Unlicensed Hearse, Rumbleweed, Inspiring Vantage Borderless, and Archmage's Newt. Pariah, Archmage's Charm, Cataclysmic Prospecting, Hostile Investigator. I love this vault frame. It looks so cool. Mythic. And Kellen joins up. One more pack. Oil Poster again. Satoru, the Infiltrator, Primal Might, Arcane Heist, Raska joins up, and Final Showdown. The Instant Speed Board White Mythic. Pretty fun one right there. Get this sleeved up for you, Josh. Thank you so much for grabbing some packs. All the variants from all the collector packs. Um, I could try. I've opened most of them since the variant started. I'm not sure I could. I mean, if I was looking at them, I probably could for sure. But two two x two draft and two OTJ collectors for Casey. Good luck, Casey. chat one minute uh we will not be streaming tomorrow no uh queen honey will be streaming saturday at one o'clock eastern time um, and I'll be streaming again Monday, 8.30 Eastern Time. There will be no battles on Saturday, but there will be battles Monday. Casey, you're getting two 2x2 draft and two OTJ collectors. Good luck. This is a pretty long list, uh, Birdie, not going to lie. But I've opened pretty much all the variant air myself. So, and a lot of it. Aurelia, the war leader, Mythic. Very nice. And Venza Rare, also getting a Borderless Borzhov or S Basilica. There we go. The Throne of Old Drain was the first modern collector pack. It had the showcase, this showcase frame. It was an adventure showcase frame. Ooh, Bitter Blossom. Nice. And Wasatora. Thirst Beyond Death had the, uh, I didn't open a lot of that, but it had the Starfield frame. I don't know what they called that. The God frame. Um, Ikoria had the 
uh the mutate frame was pretty cool nexus of becoming big score foil mythic mana drain what a pack casey congrats behan extended mythic are we at three mythics we are at three mythics chat ah uh, rare dust animus and botanical sanctum uh core 21 had the core 21 fancy frame like the one that went with the legendary like the fairy and basri and all that um also had some pretty cool frame break stuff before it was called frame break fortune little steed i nice gray waters fixer transmutation font extended mythic and uh one last job or rare Zendikar rising had the uh obviously the expedition frame the expedition hunt but uh it was more the like cornered border the landfall type ish frame i don't know what they called that either uh then call time was the snow frame and then the metal frame heavy metal looking frame showcase Strixhaven had mystical archives it didn't have another variant um what was after Strixhaven? i don't remember somebody can tell me what was after Strixhaven. i could probably tell you what we opened in that Commander Legends was in there. They had etched frames for the first time. Ooh, it's real getting a 2x2 collector. That sounds fun. Yeah, there have been some busto pack. Uh, two Broke Collectors, a DMR Collector, and two Val Collectors. This will be fun. MH2 had that ugly sketch frame. What do you like? The rain fire. So two Val, DMR, two Bro, and a 2x2. Good luck, Tyrell. Um. Then we had Midnight Hunt and Crimson Vow that had the uh, the black and white edged frame. I'll show you here in a second. We had the lands, obviously. Overcharged Amalgam, Camber Extended Commander, Change of Fortune, Low Pedal Solo Brink, Gluttonous Guess. It had, not that, uh, Dracula Blood Immortal, and it had the Fang frame in, uh, in by invitation only, full extended the Fang frame in this for vampires, and then it had like the day night frame for the werewolves yeah these sets are fun to open the old stuff edgar charm groom that's fun haunting imitation commander alpac piper uh i got the box topper quincy harker there edgar again and showcase the fang frame and ooh, a borderless full dream root cascade what was our other was it a rare it was a rare. Yeah, Dracula was the rare. Got it. Brothers were up next. 2x2 I'm doing last. Always save the uh, the pricier products for last. For the most part. Unless it's a really complicated order. Steel Seraph. Rushland Borderless. Scavenge, Scavenge Brawler Extended. Ornithopter. Burnished Heart. Blackbade Reforged Sketch. Soundwave Transformer, and a full Chromatic Lantern. Figure that's how most people want to see it. So that's how that's how I would want it done. So that's how I do it. If somebody wants different, they're happy to tell me. I'm happy to... Uh... No, we got another pack to get a Mox Amber, though. Hopefully we hit it in this one. Third Path Iconoclast. That was over a buck at one point. Temporal Anchor, Teresian Mindbreaker, The Mill Cards, Scholar of New Horizons, with the Boots, nice, Foundry Inspector, Sword of the Meat, we have a Shattered Glass Goldbug Transformer, and a Foil Mechanized Warfare, that's a pretty mean card in uh, Mono Red Aggro. DMR up next. Yeah, Mox Hambers are really, really hard hit. The DMR rares are in the front, we have a Borderless Foil Mythic Hunting Grounds, that's fun. Oversold Cemetery Borderless, Old Border Mind Slicer, a Foil Overmaster, 
beautiful swamp there and foil as well then your 2x2 collector pack with whatever that thing is Garrett doing well how are you doing tonight Good luck Old Steel Heart, Unearth, Blesnia Sanctuary, Lightning Bolt Foil, that's pretty sick. Ugari Rock Farm Foil, first rare or mythic is a Tarkas Command. We have a Borderless, Cedrus, the Trader King, that art, art hits so hard. Ian Miller on that one. Then we have an etched rare privileged position and a Borderless Foil, rare Pissing Needle. Come on, Booster Pack. Sorry, Terrell, that uh, pissing needle's a rough hit in that last slot, but unfortunately, sometimes it happens. Yeah, that that's about sums up the Double Masters 2022 Collector Pack. Open a set booster case and only one box amber. They are hard pulls. Edward, getting an Outlaws Collector Pack. We do still have Outlaws Collector Packs in stock chat, if anybody would like to grab. I need to open a new box. So one pack snipe, good luck. Edward, here we go. Extra to raise foil. What's your poison? They're uh, they're fun pulls for sure. That's the luck. Starting out with ooh, mind slaver. It is textured mind slaver. We got two textured in this case. This is the uh, last box of the case. Can we hit a raised foil too? That would be sick. Congrats. And a Contagion Engine. What a pack. That is so cool. I love the art on this. It's beautiful. In a weird way, but very beautiful. Congrats, Edward. One pack snipe getting the Mind Slaver. Love to see it. Also getting that Contagion Engine, Thunderclap Drake, High Noon, and Duelist of the Mind. So congrats on that. Very, very nice uh, timing on that one pack tonight. Jonathan up next, getting a Strix Haven collector pack. These are so fun, chat. Thank you for letting me open one up for you. Here we go. 84 likes. Yeah, we've not hit the Yeehaw button yet. We gotta get to 100 likes for that. Eat a debate. Uh, so we start out with a lesson. This can be a rare mythic, sadly not here. A uh, selfless glyph weaver that flips into deadly vanity. Healing technique, extended commander. Wandering archaic, that's a pretty good one. Uh, flips into explore the vast lands. And we have opt and etched. Gift of estates and etched. Foil claim the firstborn. And a foil torrent sculptor with flamethrower sonata. There you go, Jonathan. We'll get those sleeved up. Yeah, we're sold out at 2x2. We had two collector boxes tonight. We'll probably have some more on Saturday. Uh, it's not something we have a lot of, so we don't tend to put a lot of it up at one time. <laughs> Shannon up next, getting a Dragons of Tarkir and a Mystery Booster. Sounds fun. There you go. Good luck. Two sets we haven't opened in at least a week. We do have 2x2 draft packs, just no more collectors for tonight. Should have more collectors on Saturday. Uh, Icefall Regent Rare Dragon and a Foil Vile Dragonfire. That's a pretty cool looking foil. On here, Mystery Booster. Impact Tremors, very nice. I know it's gone down since the reprint, but it's a good one. And it's funny because it's in Dragons of Tarkir, which we just opened. Regardless Agent. 
I didn't realize they upshifted that for MH2. Wild. Crystal Chimes. Chancellor of the Annex from, uh, I think that's New Phyrexia. Pretty cool. Ooh, and a Mythic Dragon Lord of Utai. Also from Dragons of Tarkir. Celest Celestine Cave Witch. For your test card. We'll get those sleeved up. And uh, now we've made it to Black T. Black T, good luck. You have your one collector box, your Outlaws collector box, and your nine mom collector pack. We'll probably start with the uh, start with the loose packs, and then we'll open your two boxes. So we have your Outlaws collector box from earlier, your one collector box here, and then your nine mom collector packs. Ah, uh, no, Kim, we don't. Okay, so we're starting out with March of the Machine. Good luck, Black D. Here we go. After this, we have two orders for Angelino, uh, Marisha, Noah, Stephen, Matthew, Jacob, Garrett, Miss, Julian, Garrett, and Tyrell. So we are starting with Invasion of Kaldheim, Rare, City on Fire, Fire Main Commando, Agar, Etched Agar, Victorious Full Rare, and Luris of the Dream Deck. Also have Zach getting some packs. Thank you, Zach. Yargle and Multaney. Vitali, very nice in the showcase. Vivian's Talent, Finn. Valdek Etched, Voldaren Thrill Seeker, Extended Foil, and Umori. People can do some stupid stuff with that Voldaren Thrill Seeker chat. It is wild. Thrill Seeker and Yargle and Multaney. The fun uh, little mini combo there. Archpriest of Shadows, Hidetsugu and Kairi Showcase, Path of the Ghost Hunter Extended, Virja. Etched Wrath, Will Doomscar Warrior. And this Ram, Senior Artificer. Leave those up and then open your next three packs. Marisha, do people, what do they say? Do they just say Marsha and drop the eye? Baral and Kerry Zev, Tribute to the World Tree, Liliana's Talent, Rona. Etched Finn, Full Infernal Sovereign Extended Mythic. Ooh, let's go! Serialized hit chat number 87 of 500 Arithmeses Slumbering Isle and that beautiful double rainbow foil. Congrats. A fun start here. I can get it in the top loader. We did it, chat. We did it. We got there. We got there. Congrats. Still have more packs to go. Strong start for Black P. Invasion of Ixalan, Chandra, Borderless Mythic, Death Greatest Champion, Renata, Halo Rayav, Melissa, Showcase, and a full Tesa. So that's our, uh, our first serialized of the night, chat. Yeah? I haven't opened a serialized in a while. Rowan's Talent. Ooh, Iker Shieldred. Very nice. Pain Distributor. Daxos. Etstrada. Full Guardian of Jiraper. And a Hirobi. Death's Whale. Uh, we leave those up. And then we'll get to the next three. Oh, there. Got it. Dinosaur token. Not very happy about the dino. Z double. Brawl and carry Zev. Flock Chaser Phantom. Zada. That's Drona. Ooh, foil Itali. Nice. And Thalia, Guardian of Thraven.
This is actually March of the Machine, not uh, Phyrexia all v one Vision of Fiora, Rogsa and Kunoros Mythic, or Orthean Extended, Rayav, Renata Etch, Tribute to the World Tree Extended Foil, and Yorian in Etch. One more pack. Uh, everything's by the pack on the stream, Super Care. It is uh, 2349 a pack for Brothers War Collector Pack. Tribute to the World Tree, Voldaren Thrill Seeker, Path of the Animus, Valda, Halofin, Team Trathorum, Carlos Extended Foil, Mythic, and a Grim Grin. That's actually the very first card we pulled and serialized from the set, I think. If I remember right, Jimmy, uh, Jimmy Lodge might have got that one. So, got our uh, first one here. Put these put away. We'll open your Brexia collector box. Brexia LB1 did not have serialized cards. Rainfire's auditioning for the John Snow roll. Uh, so we have 12 1 collector packs up next. This is a fun set for sure. Okay, so here we go. Double checking something real quick. That won't be good. Here we go. Oh, Snore would be fun. Uh, Shoulder is a super hard pull because it only comes in the concept crater slot. But you know that. Dark Slick Shores, Borderless Foil, Brexian Jace Mythic, Brand, Stepping Complete Rare. Got two commons there. Just Goria, Forge Tire, Extended Mythic, Venerated Rot Priest, and Tyvar, Jubilant Brawler. So you can get up to six rares in these packs. This one's weird because it doesn't have the indestructible packs, but they're still hard to open. Indictive Flame Stoker, Kaya Manga, Mirror Convert, Step and Complete, Mirage Mockery, Argenta Mask Score, ooh, and Sword of Forge Frontier. Sword was a pretty hard pull in the slot because it didn't have any showcase version. Dopendrel, Hunger Dominus, Ikerfoil Mythic, Uvika, Quicksilver Fisher, Step and Complete. More Fisher, Clever Concealment, Indictive Flame Stoker, and Encroaching Mycosin. That's your first three packs. We'll sleeve those up quick. Next three. Starting out with a Foil Kaya Manga. The Run, Breaker Silence, Scamp Step and Complete. Wormquake, Tablet of Completion, and Thrun. Still breaking the silence. If you break the silence the first time, can you break it again? Is that how that works? I'm not sure. Uh, Nahiri, Foil, Manga Mythic, Unctus Icker. Ooh, Tyrannix Rex, Stepping Complete. That is a mean mythic. Yes, Summons, Nord's Wellspring, and Black Sun's Twilight. Big Stompy Boy. 8-8, eight, eight, can't be countered, trample, toxic, 4, ward, 4, and haste for 4 and 3G. Lux Artillery, Ekuthal, Iker Mythic, step and complete. Norn Squire Master, Dragon Wing Glider, and Venzer, Corpse Puppet. Break these up. Uh, we've had core 2021 20, collectors in for on and off for the last few months mirrored safe house full extended scrove 
Bras, Unstoppable, Juggernaut, and Manga Step and Complete. Uh, Monumental Corruption, Mind Splice Apparatus, and Green Sun's Twilight. Um, we have not had it. I think we sold out like one or two streams before Outlaws. Um, I'm definitely going to start looking into getting some other stuff. Evolve Spinoderm, Icker Foils, Soap and Drill, Mythic Icker, The Rat Step and Complete. My Overseer, Zenith Chronicler, and Kethic Crucible Goliath. Um, it'll just depend on timing, though. Um, normally, the first couple weeks after a new set comes out, it's pretty crazy around here, so I don't have as much time to do that type of stuff. Monumental Facade, Razor Verge Thicket, Rust Fine Cultivator, Step and Complete, Serum Sovereign, Polluted Contaminator, and Blade of Shared Souls. But, uh,. Uh, it's definitely not out of the question uh if you're in our discord exclamation point discord moon bottle give you an invite to join if you're not there's a product request channel if we're out of stock of something you're looking for drop a question in there and i go back and look through there when we're looking to order stuff for the stream the other hard thing is pricing right so like core 21 collectors foil manga kemba malira manga as well i believe unctus step and complete uh, that's not something we can get from distribution anymore. Lugs Artillery, Mirror and Safe House, and Secret Coast Foil Rare. So that's something that's going to be a little bit more expensive uh, just because it's harder for us to get. But we've definitely had them in stock before. So possible to get it again. Green Suns Twilight, Venzer Icker, Anchor Bloom Step and Complete, Roar of Resistance, Bat Blade of Shared Souls, and a Soulless Jailer. So the Soulless Jailer cannot share the blade of shared souls i guess sounds like how it would work uh vran icker vran non icker then you dance your step and complete three more rares glistening sphere monument to perfection and evolve spinoderm to end your box get all those sleeved up definitely some fun stuff in there you got a lot of dominus um, got a lot of the step and complete foil rares and mythic. So appreciate you for grabbing that. And then we have your outlaws collector box. Last but not least for black tea. Grab a drink of water real quick, chat. So after this, we do still have plenty of packs to open up for people, but it's not a crazy long list. Most people just get in a few packs, so uh, not going to take a crazy long time down to get to the bottom of that. Here is your collector box of outlaws. Good luck, Black Key. Hope we find what you're looking for here. Pack one. Pack the packs that are difficult but still easier to open. Uh, Tiny Bones joins up. Pest Infestation. Greywater's Fixer. Magda. And, ooh, Sword of Wealth and Power. Big pull there. Nice. Congrats. Swords just always seem like they're going to do well long term to me. And that one just seems really fun. Not one you see a lot, right? Malcolm. Wanted poster, Indomitable Creativity Mythic, Angel of Indemnity, Campbell, and Hellspur Possible. Chat, did we ever get to 100 likes? I know we were trying to get to 100 likes. I don't know if we ever did. We are so close. We're at 99. We need one more. Rainfire says yes. That must mean we just crossed 100. Whoa, Roxanne. Detention Sphere, Cataclysmic Prospecting, Kerbic, and Lila. Just verify real quick. And then we can press the button, chat. 116. Wow, that jumped fast. That jumped real fast. Thank y'all for hanging out. Appreciate you. Anguish I'm making for Mythic. Bell the Mighty. Angelic Cell Sword. Annie Flash, the veteran wanted poster. Ooh, and a bristly Bill Mythic, too pretty fun let's leave these up
Yeehaw, indeed. Oil extended, colossal rattle worm, rule ultimatum, Dan scout, double down, extended mythic, and tiny bones joins up. We should still have both outlaws, uh, play and collector packs in stock, I believe. Let me double check. I haven't checked in a while. We do have both play and collector packs still in stock if anybody wants to grab some. Have a foil, another round. Crackle with power, mythic, cactus preserve. Helen joins up and Vraska joins up. How is Garrett doing this evening, chat? Well, blue card. Archmage's Charm, nice. Pariah. Smoldering Stagecoach, Duels to the Mind. Ooh, and an Esoteric Duplicator, Big Score Mythic. One more pack before our next sleeve here for Black P. Sounds like something Rainfire would do. A, ooh, Foil Special Guest Desert. These are so hard to pull, only in 3% of packs. Archive Trap, Felix Five Boots Extended Foil Mythic, Insatiable Avarice, and a more Insatiable Avarice. Leave these up for more packs. New system's causing a lot of issues, but something one is almost over. Uh, ooh, final showdown. Nice extended flow mythic. And a Oko mythic. Thief of Crowns, the reprint. Dune Chanter, Simulacrum Synthesizer, extended big score mythic, and Wily Duke. That was like three mythics. That was a great pack. Week one is almost over. Gotcha, gotcha. Oil, extended. Vaultborn Tyrant, big score mythic. Nice. Imps Mischief. Olivia, borderless mythic. Dust Animus. And Rakdos, the Muscle Mythic. So, getting a lot of Mythics here in the close. Two more packs for Black Tea. Hope you're enjoying all your openings. I really do appreciate you getting all the packs. Key to the Vault. Surgical Extraction. Embrace the Unknown. Lotus Ring. Very nice. In the Vault Frame Mythic non-foil. Big score. Uh, now cast a Trailblazer. One more pack. We got... Doris. That sounds sounds boring. What is this? Ooh, borderless foil, spire bluff canal, outlaws merriment, rumbleweed. Ooh, Vraska wanted poster. That's sick. And laughing Jasper Flint. Black D. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for grabbing some packs. You're gonna get all these leaved up. Put in your box. And, uh, yeah, doing the thing. Let me get all these put away. Then Angelino up next getting seven outlaws click packs. Angelino has two orders, one for five and one for two. We're just gonna open them up together. They are back to back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three, four, three, seven. Don't you love it when that happens, Garrett? Ooh, Mind Slaver Foil Mythic, Skull Crack, Dream Thief's Bandana, Hostile Investigator Extended Mythic, and a Memory Vessel, Big Score Mythic. For pack one. Oh, Harvester of Misery, Extended Big Score Mythic, Collective Defiance, Stell Leap, Borderless Commander Mythic, Claim Jumper, and Malcolm the Eyes. So chat, in about a week, you should uh you should let me know. There are any commons and uncommons breaching a dollar? Fibblethip, Borderless Foil, Fill in the Swealth, Arachi Soul Reaver, Three Steps Ahead, Pitiless Carnage. Still a bit too early to really feel where the commons and uncommons in the set are going to be. But after, normally after release day, by a couple days, 
I try to take a look. Let's see where we're at. Oil, pest infestation. Dotsies, nice mythic. Back in town. Kellen the Kid, wanted poster mythic. And Giza, oil mythic. Wow, a lot of mythics there. Their Mana Crypt special guest is only in Lost Caverns of Ixalan. That is the only set you can get the Mana Crypt special guest in. It is not in any other set. High Noon, Primal Might, Forge's Foundry. Annie joins up, and Annie really joins up. She's there, chat. She's part of the team. She wants to let you know she's joining up twice. She is excited. Let's go. Couple more packs for Angelina. Good luck. Will Siphon Insight, Path to Exile, Discreet Retreat, Free Strider Lookout, and Fibble Tip lost on the range. One final pack for you. No problem. Oil, Extended, Flick Shot Show Off. A lot of people excited about that. Siphon Insight, Poetic Charge, Legion Extruder, Big Score Vault Frame Mythic, and Ultek Matter Weaver, Big Score Mythic. There you go, Angelino. Hope you enjoy your polls. I need more sleep. What you're saying is companies need better processes. Is that, is that the thing? I have some more Ixalan collectors coming. I have two boxes coming. I'm not sure when they're going to arrive. But I have some on the way. It will not be cheap. Excellent collectors are ridiculously expensive now. We gotta make some more name cards chat and then we'll continue opening packs and Marisha is up next. the problem is like as companies get bigger they get obviously less nimble and then like there's so many people you have to train so many intertwined systems and everything's been patched together for years or decades and then like they're like oh this will fix all of our problems and they're like oh yeah we have these other 42 problems that we've been ignoring for the last 12 years I remember I worked in accounting at uh, I don't even know what the company's called anymore. It's called Westrock at the time. They did like a major accounting system changeover. It was just such a brain wreck. Well, it's just like there's so many people with competing interests in corporations and like so many people just care about quarterly profits or their next bonus and like bill knows he's going to be there for four years but bob's only going to be there for four months and bob doesn't want to do that now so bob suggests something else and then leaves yeah let's make sure the order's right marisha noah steven matthew jacob garrett myth julian garrett again Darrell, zach Bryn, anthony jack and odious cards perfect if we have any box topper shenanigans, we do. Uh, is he an R collector? Real. Brain, Kaltheim, Learning Special Edition, OTJ, whoa, MKM, OTJ. Okay, so no other box. Got it. A 
We're part of a small business, 13 employees. It's an insane the amount of work that needs to be done even when you're not at work. Oh, 100%. I believe that. Moonshot's a small business. I don't know how many employees we have all together, but it's not a lot. And there's just always so much going on. Like this week is magic release and rip and ship shipping. Or well, pre-release, but for all intents and purposes, it's release. Good luck on your packs, Marisha. Planes. Free Strider Lookout Rare. Pack one. And sealed courtyard getting a nice uh fast land there. Archmage's charm, esoteric duplicator, big score mythic, Girid, mirror of wilds mythic, and duelist of the mine for a four rare pack. Let's go. You got some fun mythics in there too. Yeah, LGS is a very, very hard business chat. Pitless Carnage Rare. It uh takes a lot. Next time be like, how big's your budget? Loot, the key to everything. Big score mythic and Malcolm the Ah. One more pack. Bell the Mighty Rare, Silvala Mythic, and a Magda Rare for a three rare pack. You got a lot of uh, good multi rare packs there, Marisha. I hope you enjoyed them. We'll see these up. I honestly don't know, Aaron. I'm a very bad deck builder. I like modifying pre cons and people handing me decks. I'm not a good deck builder. I get so overwhelmed and just shut down. Noah getting two 2x2 collectors and a Commander Master collector. Good luck. That's awesome. It's a hard pull. I'm glad you got it. And hopefully we can pull up for you. Well, I guess you're not getting that tonight. You got woo stuff. We're definitely not pulling that for you. Thank you, B. Hey, good to see you. Hope life's treating you well. Let's open Commander Masters last. Double Masters came out first. That's wild, Jeremy. I just like the set seems really fun to me. Seeker of the way. Terminate, Oil Spell Pierce, Oil Rampant Growth, Ring to Light Rare, Moldrotha Borderless Mythic, and Harmonicon Etched, and a Foil Oracle of Moldaya for pack one. Monastery Swift Sphere, Inquisition of Kozilek. Zali Pride Mage Foil, Rule Turf Foil, Abbot of Carol Keep Rare, Arden Scales Borderless, Etch Damnation. That looks sick. This is one of the coolest etch cards you can ever hit. And a Foil Damnation. Well, Damnation. A lot of uh, a lot of Damnation going on. Here is your Commander Master Collector. Let's see what we can find here. Planes, Frantic Search, Red Return, Command Tower Foil, Maelstrom Wanderer for your first rare. Etch Demonic Tutor, let's go. Big hit there, congrats. Ooh, and a Sliver Grave Mother Extended Foil Mythic, that's cool. Kindred Dominance, Borderless, and a Foil Deadly Rollick. What a pack. A lot of uh, black cards in that pack, but beautiful pack. Hope you enjoy playing black. That was a fun one. 
No, congrats. Even up next, getting two Outlaws Collector Packs. We do still have Outlaws Collector Packs in stock if anybody wants some. I already opened Black D. I don't know why I'm leaving that up there. Have it, I guess. The yellow leave up. See what we find you, Steven. Starting out with Wiley Duke. Reanimate. Leyline Dowser, a coolly unrepentant and inspiring vintage. It was a very inspiring place to hang out. Yeah. Helen the Kid, Foil Wanna Poster Mythic, Primal Command, Savvy Trader, Dog Sphinx, and Fortune, Little Steed. Appreciate you grabbing some packs, Steven. Get those sleeved up. Helen Wanda poster is really cool looking. Sorry, check. Give me a minute. Sorry, chat. I just need one more minute. Okay, sorry. A lot of things going on here on the back end. Matthew up next, getting two OTJ collectors and a 2x2 collector. Last 2x2 collector. Good luck, Matthew. Yeah, that's fine. I can do that. Starting out with Primal Command, Abrupt Decay, Thieving Varmint, Breaches, and Slick Shot Show Off. Back to. Ultek Matter Weaver, Foil Big Score Mythic, Void Rend, Eris Extended Mythic, Caustic Bronco Extended, and Rush of Dread Rare. Now for your Double Masters 2022 Collector Pack. Grapple with the past. Shadowborn Apostle, nice. Boiling Oracle. Mirror Aqueduct. Burning Tree Emissary. Summit Growth Chamber. First Rare or Mythic is... Tolgan's Command, followed by Borderless. Assassin's Trophy. Then an Etched. Arena Lich Queen, last card. Please be a banger. It is a Mythic. 
Oh, nice. Imperial seal. Let's go. Congratulations. Makes it worth it right there. Yep, we got there. Took the last card, but we got there. Jacob getting six collector packs. Good luck. Well, yeah. Time to find more. Liquid Soldier, thank you for subscribing. Six collector packs for Jacob. Two, four, six. Good luck, Jacob. Chat, probably going to do last call here shortly if you want to get some packs. Get them in soon. Collective Defiance, Archive Trap, Cataclysmic Prospecting, Rush of Dread, Gearid, Foil Mythic. Nice. Uh, foil, Primal Might, Skull Crack, Arcane Heist, Fortune Loyal Steed, and High Noon. We'll probably give like another, I don't know, five, ten minutes to get pack orders in for the rest of the night. Collector's Cage, Foil Borderless, or Foil Vault Border Mythic from the big score. Collector's Cage, English Stone Making Mythic, Vihan Extended Mythic. Foil, Roostarl, and Step Between Worlds. But I gotta get up and finish packing y'all's orders tomorrow so we can get them all in the mail. Uh, anything from tonight, we'll ship next week on Thursday, the 18th. Uh, Here we go. Uh, Borderless Foil Concealed Courtyard. Surgical Extraction. Vihan Extended Mythic. Non-Foil. One last job. Ooh, and a big score. Mythic. Nexus of Becoming. Have a good night, Behay. Thanks for coming to hang out. A foil loot. The key to everything. Big score. Mythic. This is not the raised foil, though. Just the regular foil. Licensed Hearse, Arachi Soul Reaver, Pillage the Bog, and Riku of many, many paths. Last pack for you, Jacob. Dinger back there. Mana Drain. Very nice. Crackling Spell Slinger. That's cool, too. Dinner's Plunder, Big Score, Vault Mythic, and Hell to Pay. So, uh, Jacob doing well there. Congrats, Jacob. Here up next, getting two play and a collector. Uh, we had battles earlier tonight. My brain is no longer in the capacity to battle. So we'll have battles, more battles on Monday, Scorch. Told yourself you weren't going to buy this set. Is it growing on you? I think it's a fun set, personally, but two play and a collector pack for Garrett. Here we go. Just want this sword? Good luck. Well, if you have an addiction, you shouldn't get any. Challenge wins up full rare. Insatiable Avarice. We're not trying to uh, do that to you, Rainfire, but you know that. 
Grand Arbiter is in standard. Too many Garrett's in chat. I'm so confused. Terrific Steed Rare. Just kidding. Y'all are awesome. Oil. Territory Forge, Big Score Extended Mythic, Iron Eyes, Third Grave Robber, Honorary Temple Wag, and a Torpor Orb, Big Score Mythic. So there is your first opening gear. We'll get those sleeved up. You have some more coming up in a little bit. Myth, getting one pack snipe. Good luck, Myth. There were like four Justins the other day. Justins unite. Hey, chat. We'll give it till 1220. You have three more minutes to get pack orders in for tonight. We call it a little early tonight. It's day seven of eight. No, for sure not. So what you don't see is on the other side of your name card. It's got your full name on it. So what we do is I don't have an example. Say this says Lance on it. It has your order number. This side has your order number and says Lance Cawthorn on it. So what we do is we take your cards. We flip this over, put it in front, and then it's got your full name on it. So unlicensed hearse. That's a fun one, Myth. Reanimate. Also fun. Dune Chanter. Extended health for Posse Boss. And an Archangel of Ties. Getting a white mythic there. But uh, blue was nowhere to be found. Julian up next, getting one pack snipe on the play booster. If you really want to know Myth's name, it's really just Myth Sparkle. Archangel of Tides, there it is again. Non-foil, obviously. But uh just pulled that for myth. And now Julian has one too. Congrats. Pat Garrett's back, getting a collector pack. It's a mystery. Let's see what you did there. Malcolm, full wanted poster, grindstone mythic, tower winder extended, tarnation vista extended mythic. What in tarnation chat? It's a Bruce Tarl. Bruce, what you doing in this booster pack? Sorry, Garrett, we tried. Did get tarnation vista though. Terrell up next. Getting two OTJ collectors. ZNR collector. ELD collector. HM collector. And two litter. That looks good. We'll just do it this way. Cal time first. Is rock on, right? Here it's soon order now. That's fine. That'll be our last one for the night. So, Kaldheim, we have a snow covered forest. Crown of Skemfar, Doomscar, Kusima, Maja, Hunting Voyage, Borderless Mythic, Merit of the Frost, and Skemfar Avenger, Foil Extended. On to Outlaws of Thunder Junction. Gonna put up a uh, little line on the schedule here in a minute, chat. Fibblethip Lost on the Range, Dust Bowl, Greywater's Fixer, Geralt, Mythic Poster, Wanted Poster, and a Cooley Unrepentant. Double Fling. There it is. A uh, Foil Archive Trap. Nice. Void Rend. Heartless Conscription, Calamity, and Carvec the Punisher. Got to save for this weekend. Going to LGS, or what are you doing this weekend? 
Thrunavel Drain Collector Pack. These are fun. They can be pretty mean, but when they hit big, they hit big chat. So you get three showcase. They can be rare mythics. We have a rare giant killer. Thrunavel Tree Folk and Queen of Ice. Then you get a ancillary card. This one is a rare Empress Skyblazer. Then you get extended art. Urban Champion. Then you get a foil, which is extended art pretty rarely. We just get a showcase, but a Bone Crusher Giant. That was a house in standard. Wyoming, that sounds fun. Here's Zendikar Rising. Starting with Orin Reef Ooze. Rag Crown and Timber Crown Pathway. Got uh, the showcases. Omnath, Mythic Showcase. That's pretty cool. Then you can hit an Expedition in this last slot, do we? We do not. You get a Tijuru Paragon, full extended. Leave these up, and then you have two special edition packs. Thank you so much for subscribing. That orders are closed for tonight. Appreciate all your support. Put the message up now. That is like the longest thing ever. The orders are closed for this evening. Appreciate all the support tonight, y'all. I just got to pack up more packs tomorrow. So, to make sure this is nice and bright and big. Here we go. actually sticking to it tonight so um anything ordered after now will be opened by queen honey on saturday at 1 p.m eastern time uh we did open one commander masters collector pack tonight reprieve that's nice song of irindal the grot silver foil nazgul battle may scene Booby sack bag and surge and a lauren searing light surge foil with a silver foil elvish harbinger now omnath is pretty cool one of the blue forest petrified wood force that sounds really cool grima sarman's footman orcish siege master silver foil ramus ecker scene file of gladrial surge Ooh, glittering caves of aglaron gemstone cavern surge the souls attendant that's a pretty nice uh Box stopper hit there and search full. Congrats. There you go, Tyrell. We'll get this sleeved up for you. Uh, Zach's up next, getting two plate and one collector of outlaws. This is a pretty big one, not going to lie. Appreciate all subscriptions tonight. I didn't realize we got up almost to 16, 8, 25. Five more to go. Still need five more Twitch followers to hit uh, 740 tonight. That's our goal for this evening. Roll Ultimatum Rare, Ancient Cornucopia, Big Score, Mythic, and Tywa Keen for a three rare pack. Very nice. Yeah, getting a minute right now is pretty hard, Garrett. If somebody reminded me in like a week, I would love to. Another round rare, but uh, this week's kind of don't have a lot of time sounds good foil lila extended Illness wealth forger's foundry rakdos joins up in blooming marsh your last pack there zach thank you so much for grabbing some packs we get these sleeved up for you right now to rin up next five oh set and one woke collector go 
Got a upside down gold stamped art card. Cool. Cool. We can do upside down. Song of Toten Tons, an intangible virtue. Penum's Aura from Scourge. I have no clue if that's worth anything. My favorite card from Wildspell Drain. I don't know. I really like the. I know that's not what you're asking. Baluna, Grand Squall Mythic. Or, uh, ask me after I've had a chance to play it on Arena. Chanting Tales Art is really cool. This set was really well done. Tough Cookie, that was a really fun card in draft. Spell the Interlopers, Leyline of the Void, and a full rare Malevolent Witch, Witch Cake. Uh, loose Cannon, yeah, I'll just push back to your first one to your second one. Archon of the Wild Rose Rare. Last set pack. Got the Moonshaker Cavalry art card. Uh, Blossoming Tortoise Mythic and Waste Knot for another rare. And now for your collector pack. Lock. Here we go. Foil, as foretold. Polluted Bonds anime, Questing Druid, Food Fight, and Restless Fine Stock. So thank you so much for grabbing some packs. We'll get these sleeved up for you. Get them shipped out on Thursday next week. Anthony up next, getting all sorts of packs. Definitely uh, excited for all the all the new people that found us during Outlaws Thunder Junction pre-sales. Welcome to the community. It's been great having you all. Uh, hope you stick around. We normally stream Monday and Thursday at 30 Eastern time. That's when I stream. Queen Honey streams on Saturdays at 1 o'clock. At least for this week we'll see hopefully that'll be a regular thing going forward eight play packs five carl of manor play pack eight perfect one two three four five six collectors and two special dips. Thanks, historian. Uh, two, four, and six. And then two special editions. All the booster packs back. Here we go. Yeah, orders are closed for tonight. It is day seven of eight for me streaming. Full smear, midnight's light, and I have to finish packing y'all's packages tomorrow with Sarah. So, uh, need to get out of here and hopefully be asleep by two so I could be back here and packing orders hopefully by 10. Case of the Locked Hot House. And then uh, whatever doesn't make the UPS pickup off the drive to the post office. Sounds like fun, Keeks. Expedited Inheritance Mythic. There will be no battles on Saturday with Queen Honey, but uh, we'll resume battles on Monday. We'll do some more. The car is useless by itself. Wojak Investigator Rare, Blood Spatter Analysis Rare. There needs to be a human to help. Last Carla Manor Pack, Ezrum Agency Chief. On to the Outlaws play pack.
Imp's Mischief Rare, Area of the Gala Rare. Uh, we should also be opening up Modern Horizons 3 early when we get there. Should be fun. I think that'll probably start if I had to guess today. Ooh, Lost Jute, Mythic. Badmere, New Blood. If I had to guess, it'll probably start May 31st. So if you just hang out for new sets, head back around then. You can see all the new MH3 hotness. Uh, great Train Heist Rare. Happy pre-release day. It is pre-release day now. Um, that moonshot. Bibblethip lost on the range, so I guess these aren't pre-sales anymore. You can pick these up when we open. And I think we open at 10 o'clock on Fridays. Not sure, actually. Dotsies, nice mythic. And Pillage the Bog. Uh, draw off the flesh right fun mythic especially if you like zombies pre-release is gonna be fun uh it is ooh full double down mythic the devil rare bristle blood farmer big score mythic and dust animus it is uh crack and jank that wants fibble up oh uh, we've definitely opened a lot of fun stuff nothing Nothing too crazy insane, I don't think, in the last hour. No, like, serialized or anything like that. We did open a serialized tonight, but not in the last hour, I don't think. Collective Defiance, Terror of the Peaks, Nice Mythic, and Wily Duke. So those were some fun play packs. Uh, I think we might need two sleeves for that, but we'll see. You want it for the wife? Nice. Okay. Uh, we have six Outlaws Collectors and then two Special Edition Collectors. Um, there are buy box promos, but that's it, I think, with this set. High Noon, Path to Exile, Yuma, Borderless Mythic, another round extended, and Smuggler Surprise. I don't know if there's any other, like, pre-release things. I'm, uh, I'm not on that side of the business. Um, normally you could check the WPN website to see what promos are going when, but... Ooh, Foil Special Guest Desert, very cool. Void Slime, Paretic Charge, Malcolm Wanted Poster, and Caustic Bronco. The VPN website's pretty good at explaining stuff. Flickshot Show Off, Bell of the Mighty, Dead Before Sunrise, Giza Wanted Poster, nice, and Greed's Gambit Big Score Mythic. Uh, it's obviously geared toward store owners, but it lets you look at different promos that they're giving out at different stores if they qualify. Archangel of Tides, Flow Extended Mythic, Cruel Tomatum, Angel of Indemnity, Esoteric Duplicator, Extended Mythic, and Breaches, the Blast Maker. Get those sleeved up for Anthony. That, I'm going to sleep so good Saturday night. And hopefully get to sleep in Sunday morning. We have a foil contagion engine. Nice. Crime Punishment Mythic. Lock and load. Badmere and the key to the vault. Double terminal agony. Ooh, we got a raised foil, Anthony. Congrats. Loot the key. Everything. Anthony got in at just the right time. Congratulations. Also got an Electro Dominance. Sick poll. Congratulations. I think your ears would all be blown out if Queen Honey pulled that right now. Electric Dominant Sand Scout, Concealed Courtyard, and Annie Flash, the Veteran Mythic. And now, two Special Edition Collect Packs. Forest. 
Forge Anew, Silverfoil Gimli, Mournful Avenger, Gandalf, The Secret Fire, uh, Scene Mythic, Arwen, Mortal Queen, Surge Mythic, and Aragorn, Hornburg Hero, Surge, Scene Mythic with a Silverfoil Souls Attendant. One last pack here for you, Anthony. Hope you've enjoyed your pulls. Starting out with Plain Surge, Haunt from the Rampart. Silverfoil, Pippin, Warden of Isengard, Rally the Gladrim Scene, Rangers of Athelion Surge, and Pippin, Guard of the Citadel, Surge, Ring Treatment, Rare. Get those all sleeved up for you. Congrats again on the big loot pull. That's pretty cool. You need to add a... To upgrade the card storage to level two chat we've now achieved level two status all the commons commons for those uh so jack's getting a box and then we're pushing that really so odious cards gonna get the next pack and then jack's getting two boxes then we have loose cannon but we're gonna push loose cannon so we open both those together so after Jack's boxes, SLG Brenda's up next, then Loose Cannon, the Garrett, then Jacob, and then we're done. So congrats again to Anthony on that. Uh, so here's Jack's first box, gonna set that off to the side. One pack for Odious Cards. Good luck, Odious Cards. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. If you're still awake. If not, hope you enjoy the replay. One pack snipe. Have a foil. Wily Duke. Siphon Insight. Angelic Cell Sword. The Key to the Vault. And Colossal Rattle Worm. Get those sleeved up for you. That, where did our like count end up? We're at 128 likes. Can we get to 150? Make the rest of our name cards real quick, chat. Then we'll put packs for the rest of the stream. And then I will s I will not see you, but you'll hear me Saturday at one o'clock Eastern with uh Queen Honey Stream. Should be fun. If anybody does want to pre-order some packs for Queen Honey Stream, you can order packs now and you'll be first in line when she starts opening on Saturday at 1 p.m. So if you wanna Get some Queen Honey pack orders in. Anything you order now will be the first thing that she opens up on Saturday at 1 o'clock Eastern. Need another camera? Well, we're not going to be doing two people streams very often. I've been here for training, but we're going to let Queen Honey uh, do the thing by herself. So it'll be fun. I think she'll have a really good time. So Jack, here is your other box. Grab that. Go Jackbox 1, Jackbox 2. Start with box 1. Luck. Really fun set. Hope you're enjoying it. There's definitely a future where we might do some two camera stuff, but. We've got a bunch of other stuff we have to figure out first. Box one. Here we go. Nice. Have a good night. Appreciate you. Starting out with a foil. Grand Abolisher. Big score vault for a mythic. Very cool. Detention Sphere. Vengeful Growth. Botanical Sanctum. Borderless. And the Gitraw. Gravenous Ride. Foil. Regular set mythic never really watch youtube on tv maybe i should change that youtube told me 13 percent of my viewers are from tv the get rog this time in foil extended mythic path to exile kiri extended mythic stinger back terror and even interrupter or maybe it was just 13 percent from one video 13 percent seems really high 
But I guess live streams would make sense. Inspiring Vantage, Borderless Foil, Decimate. Elemental Eruption, World Walker Helm, Vault Frame Mythic, and Rakdos joins up. Yeah, for sure, Chris. I get that 100%. I just, I never think about it. Flame Jumper, Pariah, Crackling Spell Slinger, Wily Duke, and Vaultborn Tyrant Big Score Mythic. That's the first four packs of the box. We'll sleeve these up. Grab the next four. Oil, blue, archive trap, nice. Mind slaver, love that art mythic. Bounty board, dust animus, and stoic sphinx. That I wish you all the best of luck in your pre-releases if you go. Ooh, let's go! Textured force of vigor. Yeah, congratulations, beautiful card. Get that on top loader for you. Vanishing Verse is your next card. I think that's like our fourth Force of Vigor that we fold. Pretty neat. Uh, Vanishing Verse, Tower Winder, Smuggler Surprise, and Pillage the Bog. So just because you hit a texture or a raised foil definitely does not mean the case is dead. I pulled two textured from the same case before. Crazy. Outcaster Trailblazer, Prime Punishment Mythic, Dead Before Sunrise, Fire Bluff Canal, Borderless, and one last job. Why are there no serialized cards in the set? Because they don't put serialized cards in every set, and there are no numbers on top of the cards. Dust Bowl, Electric Dominance, Angel of Indemnity, Bonnie Paul, and Vadmir New Blood. There are basically two chases in this set, so there's not really a need for a serialized chase. Uh, the breaking news sheet has 15 mythics, like you just saw with that Force of Vigor. All 15 mythics come in a textured foil. Roughly, based on my odds of pulling, it's I've been around 1.3%. Uh, officially, Wizard states the odds is 1% of packs. The Devil, Siphon Insight, Lock and Load, Pitiless Carnage, and Dust Animus. Um, then the other chase are the raised foils that we just pulled of loot that look like Gilded Foils from Streets of New Capenna. Five of the 30 big score mythics come in that special treatment, and based on what I've pulled, I've pulled them in like 0.44% of packs. Uh, Rush of Dread, Primal Might, Smirking Spelljacker, Assimilation Aegis, Extended Mythic, and Omen Path Journey big score mythic. Um, obviously they state less than 1%, which would fall in that. I think it's fun to have different types of chases. Right? Serialized are fun. Rakdos joins up. Ooh, Mind Break Trap. Very nice. Gel Excel Sword, Terrific Steed, and three steps ahead. One more pack in this box. Uh, but it's nice to have different things instead of just the same thing. Everything. It's that, you know? And I think they figured that out finally. Force of Vigor, regular art there. In foil, Skull Crack, Cactus Preserve, Gold Vein Hydra. Nice mythic. I think that'll be a fun one. And Obeka, Splitter of Seconds. Should be a fun build around commander if you enjoy building rookie decks. Uh, so that is your first box, Jack. Congrats on that. Congrats on the textured Force of Vigor. That was pretty sweet. Get all these put away real quick, and then we'll open your second box. Then we have SLG Brenda, Loose Cannon, Garrett, and Jacob. Jack, here's your next collector box. Wish you the best of luck. Do other crazy stuff we can pull you here. I don't think, uh, at least not in that last box, we didn't pull you Mana Drain. 
leather box fuzzy, so I don't remember exactly what we got you in the first ones. Uh, but hopefully we can get you something big here you don't have yet. Starting with pack one. One last job. Commandeer. Embrace the unknown. Step between worlds and harvester misery. Big score mythic. I think the discard ability on that's going to be really strong. Uh, since it's not a spell, it can't be countered by your traditional counter spell. Given a creature minus two, minus two. Pretty cool. Uh, full geared. Mirror of the wilds. Full extended mythic. Collective defiance. Retreat, retreat. Riku of many paths in Bonnie Fall. Had quite a few people looking for that gear, so uh, might be a popular build around Commander. Then we have a Foil Stoke Sphinx, Primal Might, Dead Before Sunrise. Ooh, Vaultborn Tyrant in the big score Vault Frame Mythic. And Magda Horde Master. That slot is always non foil, so definitely not a raised foil, although that card does come in raised foil. Uh, and it's not a foil at all, actually, just a non foil. Grindstone, Foil Mythic, Fractured Identity, Double Mythic, Dream Thieves, Bandana, Ancient Cornucopia, Extended Mythic, and Collector's Cage for a four Mythic pack. Back starting this one out with Ty Keen, Perfect Shot, Primal Command, We Ride at Dawn, Blooming Marsh, and Claim Jumper. Got a Hypothesis. A uh, Full Caustic Bronco, Outlaws Merriment, Rumbleweed, Outcaster Trailblazer, and Ariette the Beguiler. Here we have a foil, void rend, unlicensed hearse, vengeful growth, insatiable avarice, and laughing Jasper Flint. One more pack here for you. Going good, Rune. How are you? Foil, ornery tumblewag, vanishing verse, Dan Scout, here we get wanted poster, nice, and a foil mythic Geralt, the flesh ride. Somebody's going to have a lot of fun with that one. Four packs left for you, Jack. Hope you've enjoyed all your openings tonight. They've been a blast. Uh, Voidrend was a rare in Streets of New Capenna. It's a rare in this. Annie joins up. Overwhelming Forces Mythic from uh, Reprint from Three Kingdoms Portal. Card Grave Robber, Colossal Rattleworm, and Concealed Courtyard. Just got home from work. Nice. No, it's a rare. Reaches. Full wanted poster. That's cool. Abrupt Decay. Smoldering Sagecoach. Tywakeen and Calamity. I, uh, I'll i be honest. I hadn't read Calamity. It's a lot of words. And I was watching Jake and Dueler Magic the other night. And that card seems pretty good in Commander. Imp's Mischief. Archmage's Charm, Leyline Dowser, Lotus Ring, we got one. Extended Art, Big Score, Mythic, nice. And Campbell, Profiteering Mayor. Forgot about the Lotus Ring a bit so long since we pulled one tonight. Ooh, got a Memory Vessel, Big Score, Foil, but not raised, Mythic, Void Slime. Felix Five Boots, Extended Mythic, Get Rog, Extended Mythic, and Ornery Tumblewag to end the box. Jack, hope you enjoyed this one as well. And all he's sleeved up right now, you're going to put away with the rest of your cards. So up next, we're going to pull uh, Loose Cannon's first pack, but we're going to set them aside. Then we're going to open up SLG Brenda. Then we'll grab the rest of Loose Cannon's packs, open them all together, and then have Garrett and Jake. mentioned a few times we'll be streaming saturday well queen honey will be i'll be here but not streaming well not on camera need more play packs
One really annoying thing, chat. They uh they didn't make the boxes foldable. You have to rip them apart. So annoying. All the other boxes for the longest time you could just fold them. They would break down, not anymore. Here are two outlaws, two one set packs. Gonna set these aside. SLG Brenda up next, getting an RVR and OTJ collector. Here we go. Good luck. Yeah, I'm not sure why it changed. Obviously, it's a new box size, but building this wealth, foil, the devil, cactus preserve, laughing jasper flint, and serific steed for. Your outlaws pack. But it's just like you had folding draft boxes. Why can't you have folding play boxes? Serialized pull would be sick, Rune, for sure. Do we get? How about a foil old border life from the loam? That's pretty sick. Protein Hulk Mythic Borderless. Backrat Old Border and Expansion Explosion. With a Golgari Signet. There you go, SLG Brenda. Thank you so much for grabbing a couple packs. Reminder chat, if you got packs tonight, as long as you didn't fill up your shipping option, you can get more packs on Saturday or Monday streams without paying for shipping again, as long as you stay under your pack limits. Loose Cannon getting two more OTG play pack. Here they are. So here are your two orders. Good luck, Loose Cannon. Two and four. Queen Honey would be uh, probably pretty overwhelmed, but it'd be fun. Luke uh, Mythic. Rexing Arena Rare. On to Outlaws. We'll definitely open 72 packs over the case course of the stream bow commandeer rare railway brawler mythic and one last job wow a lot of rares there at least i think she will people been pretty awesome uh with the queen honey sport it's been really cool do i start 22 from the u.s that would be trial by fire uh riku of many paths i think we only have belgian jump start 22 right now Uh, Vraska joins up. One more pack for you here, Loose Cannon. Good luck. Rail by Rainfire. Archmage's Newt Rare. Honest Rustine. What a weird name for a card. Get this sleeved up for you, Loose Cannon. Gear up next. Gear, good luck getting the Outlaws Collector Pack. Last Outlaws Collector Pack of the night. Chat. We do have a foil, not a raise though. Demi Lacrim Synthesizer from the Big Score Vault Treatment. Wow, mind break trap. Let's go. Vengeful Growth, Dust Animus, and Bristlebud Farmer Big Score Mythic. Fun pack there. Congrats, Garrett. Not a sword, but you got a mind break trap. I don't know where prices are going to end up, but maybe you could trade one for the other. If you don't need one, don't want one. No problem, Garrett. Thanks for grabbing the pack. Jacob's going to close the stream down, y'all. Thanks for all the support tonight. It's been a lot of fun. 2 0 and 2 1 collect. Let's do it. Good luck. Super happy. Awesome to hear it. Jacob, let's see what you get. Ekuthal, full Iker Mythic Dominus, Evolved Spinoderm, Stepping Complete, Herbrass Anointer, More Anointing, Gold Warden's Gambit, the Filigree Salix, and the Filigree Salix again. That was a double duplicate pack, unfortunately. The Noiner, you expect that. There are only like seven uncommons and six commons or something like that. But 
the filigree socks is annoying. Ovika foil. Ooh, Frexing Vindicator Icker. Love that treatment. Then you dance for step and complete. Two rats, staff of the storyteller, Red Sun's Twilight, and Kemba. Now we have your two woke collector packs. The battles will resume on Monday. I'll be doing battles on Monday. No battles with Queen Honey on Saturday. And then uh Yeah, Saturday, one o'clock Eastern. Would love it if you joined us. Spell the interlopers full extended waste knot, decadent dragon, sentinel of lost lore, and a foil feral encounter for pack one. A petty incoming would be sick. Jacob, can we do it? Good luck. Uh no, unfortunately not. But we do have a ley line of abundance. Goblin bombardment. Kellen, Mythic the Fable Blooded, Fairy Slumber Party, and a Restless Bivouac. So there we have it, chat. Another stream in the books. Twitch, appreciate all your support tonight. We got to uh, 735 followers. Not quite 740, but do appreciate all support. Uh, let's see if anybody's still streaming. I think probably done for tonight. Yeah, it looks like all the people we follow are done for tonight on Twitch. So we'll not be raiding anybody. Um, but we will be back on Saturday, 1 o'clock with Queen Honey. I'll be back Monday night, 8.30 Eastern Time. Until then, I hope you all enjoy your pre-releases. Good luck on all your polls if you're getting any sealed product yourself. Uh, join our Discord, exclamation point Discord. And... Uh, Love to see what you get out of your polls, whether it's your pre-release kits, your boxes, whatnot. Just really cool to see uh, what people get. Always love looking. Uh, but yeah, hope you all have a great night. And we will catch you on Saturday slash Monday.